everybody, and welcome back for more Wrong Way Up. Wasted and DE are with me this morning. Hello. That DE started walking away towards his glittery purple part of the jalopy. You can paint it anytime you want. I know, I can. <laughs> I can even use standard painting methods. Uh huh. And, and where is Mr. Space? Back here on his um, light turret that I do wonder how well that's going to survive come the first uh, acid rain. It's going to be great. They definitely won't target me because uh, I'm on the top and the acid rain will be fine. Are you going to build an umbrella on it? Sounds perfect, yep. <laughs> I feel I, like... Can we paint it like an umbrella, like a little <laughs> beach umbrella? Oh, that would be amazing. I kind of want to see that now. I bet you that's harder work than it sounds. You can get all the stripes in there and stuff. Yeah. I I mean, we could just do like four different colors, like rather than stripey. Um, or when Capac eventually shows up, make it his job. To be honest, he's probably the most equipped. I, I mean, yeah. I I'm not I'm not just saying it because it'll be a nice distraction for him and avoid him blowing it stuff up in the meantime or driving. Uh, but because he is actually good at that stuff, as you say. Uh, cool. Um, it's dark. It's likely to be dark for a bit. Do we want to drive, or shall I try and... Or shall we start designing the next trailer, and I will start building a plane? Yeah, Where is on a flat surface is good for more trailering, but there are probably more flat surfaces farther ahead, so I don't really care either way. All right, let's um, let's make some distance. I mean, around. as long as hmm? we get a bit of sun at some point. Yeah, I'm tell sure me we... the sun doesn't rise up behind the planet. Uh, uh, no, it should be rising off to <laughs> our right, I think. Yes, off to our right. Ish. It. Yeah, it doesn't rise exactly in the east. So it'll be somewhere over that way. How much magnesium do we have, by the way? Uh, let me check. <laughs> Wasted probably is most qualified to drive, but is also in the worst position to drive. We have a grand total of 24.34 magnesium. Oh. Rich. Rich. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's oh. four bullets. Something like that. <laughs> Use them wisely. Uh, shall I stop since we can currently see some? Uh, oh, can we? Sure. Okay. Uh, why not? Yeah. I, if we wiggle over there, I can use the plunge drill. All right. I will attempt to reverse with this trailer. <laughs> As long well, as the one you've only got one, bad. technically it's okay. Your issue rises. Oh, hang on, hang on. It's my moment. Oh, wait, are you going to drive? The back one. There we go. No. Ah! <laughs> yes, it is your moment. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> That's the just one perfect. Only thing I do. I have the reverse lights. I'm I'm the drill guy. You're the light guy. And more rec most recently, I've been the dead guy. Yes, I was watching the recap. You died more than I thought. Yeah, I died a lot. I made the mistake of just continuing to try, <laughs> despite staring failure in the face. I mean, it's a well-known saying: if at first you don't succeed, just give up right away. <laughs> Hey, uh, oh, that tree is jiggling This tree about. is, is, hang on, let me, is it dead? It is yep. dead. There it's we go. Dead. It's now fading into the, the ghost realm or wherever <laughs> they go. Yeah, it's back to the future, Inc. <laughs> I never existed. Uh, right, well, there's magnesium there, so I'm going to start trying to build some sort of a plane and then probably crash it into either... The end of the runway, the side of the runway, the top of the runway, or the side of the rover. My money's on successful landing, but running into the hangar, to be honest. <laughs> okay. It is, 
I like that idea. One hell of a map you've got for us here, Splitty. Just pull over anywhere, and <laughs> the bee can say, "Oh, which which ore would you like? Silver, gold, <laughs> magnesium, platinum? Yeah, yeah we've got it." <laughs> Yeah, I, I didn't really um, I didn't really want to go with the rare ore thing because I felt like that might just slow things down too much. But I didn't realise it had this much. <laughs> I probably should have tested more. I just like the fact that you could just literally stop anywhere and it's like <laughs> look down and the screen just lights up with ore. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Hammerbee. Um, but the cat pack isn't well, here yet, I so at least there's one cat I don't have to hurt. Death of the day. I mean, oh, in the end. Did you just die? No, I avoided it. Uh, I oh, successfully God. did not die. Angry drill noises is scary. <laughs> it's not angry, it's friendly. It's a super friendly drill. Just get real close to it, it likes that. Thanks, Miggy Man Mike. Uh, right, I'm going to get rid of this. And I'm going to... So, just before the stream, uh, I was asking Wasted about how his uh, new suspension <laughs> concept went yesterday. Do you think there's oh, any application for it here? Like, oh, really? could, you, could you use it for... Um... More grid. Yeah. Use it for small good. I want to have something small that works, but yeah. The only real advantage I found for it was as long as you kept the scale relatively small, it was insanely power efficient. Oh, because oh, you had the small grid wheels on the large grid rover? Because you had small wheels on a large grid rover, it was, despite the fact that you had lots of wheels, really power efficient in comparison to the large, large wheel variant. Huh. That's interesting. I, I, I had two batteries, two large grid batteries on it, um, with one blip of charge, you know, as they spawn in survival mode when you're yep. building. Uh, that was worth two hours. Wow. Jeez. Of, of driving time. Oh, I'm doing this wrong. Started building off a... Started trying to build off a uh, landing gear rather than a rotor or a hinge. It's a mistake. I want charge. So D, you you managed to um, configure some fancy folding contraption to try and make your planned trailer out of, didn't you? Yes, uh, I believe both Wasted and I have different approaches to the folding flight deck. <laughs> um, You're gonna like mine, Splitzy, I promise. His, yeah. <laughs> uh, Good. It's got I... all the tolerances. <laughs> mine, you push a button and it unfolds, and it it works pretty well. Uh, it's a little oh, shorter no. than would be ideal, but with with a couple practice flights, it's not difficult to land on. Uh huh. Because I uh, think total, I'm like twenty. Hang on, uh, math math is difficult. I think I'm just shy of fifty blocks long total from tip to tip when it's unfolded. Fifty. It might be like forty-five. Let me let me count real That's quick. That's ridiculous. I'll, I'll get back to you. That's enormous. I'm I'm probably uh, doing my math wrong. Good good luck with the uh, repairs on that once the acid rain hits. So why did it feel like for a sudden the world was tilting? Maybe the world was tilting. You went out drinking last night, mate. <laughs> no. It's normally when it happens to me. <laughs> okay, yeah, I I doubled it in my head. It's like it's like twenty six blocks long. Okay, that's 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 less ridiculous. <laughs> like it, yeah. I, I I doubled where I shouldn't have doubled. Yeah, I was like, wait a minute, fifty is fifty is too big. But it looks the part, and that's the important bit. Uh huh. Um. So for those in chat wondering where the other guys are, Capac most likely sleeping um Tex is working and 
We have not got our experienced pilot this week, but we may get him in the future. We'll see. Well, we don't have anywhere for him to, to take off and crash right now, so... <laughs> there is that. Hey, we sort of do. It's just we don't have anything to take oh, we off got and crash with. To crash, for sure. Hey! <laughs> I'm so I, I tried, hopeful that I can pull I this off just to, to, just to rub it in your face. I tried to land on it a couple times. I was like, nope, I'm not doing this. <laughs> Especially not with 209 ping. Oh yeah, that's fair. That was that was my other thought. Just wide flat surface, much better for people that might teleport around a little bit on their approach. Uh, uh, yes. Uh, I didn't see Wasted's uh, hangar solution. I I skipped around in his stream a little bit. Did you? Did that fold up on top of something that would cover the airplanes or something? Wasted. And yes, now the entire runway flips upside down. Oh. The runway becomes its own roof. You land on the runway, it folds up, then flips over on itself, and the runway is the roof. Okay. It was a long stream, so I, I, I'm not surprised I missed the actual solution. It also encompasses its own launch me mechanism. Yes, the, the catapult. What you do is you rotate the runway at high velocity. <laughs> Uh, and uh, press P at the right time. I mean, technically I could do that with this one. It's just not long enough to get quite the angular momentum that you would want. Oh, no, wait, I don't want a battery. Oh, I do want a battery. Yeah, I'm going to have to go with a skinny frame with four wheels because I, I was testing some other stuff and using a skid wheel increased your risk of crashing apparently about double from what I tested. I was able to easily land and stuff with um, four wheels, but as soon as I went down to three wheels or went to a skid wheel, it all just went very, very badly wrong. And just just to annoy Wasted and DE, we don't have the plane wheels. We don't have the plane wheels not to annoy us, but just because you don't like fun. Oh, I like fun. It's just not your fun. <laughs> also, with the uh, with the wheels, if you do uh one by ones in the back you still need two of them but it works as a visual tail wheel for a tail dragger and they work actually surprisingly well see when i did that yesterday it, it just exploded it didn't have enough give in the suspension and it just went boom uh, well you don't land on the tail wheel you land on your main gear and then let the tail come down oh uh, yeah fair if you've if you've got um if you've got a long enough runway yeah you can definitely do things that way uh, I mean, I... Okay, yeah. Uh, it's... it's. If you land all at once, it's okay. If you just land... If, you're, if your angle of attack is too big and you come in on the tail wheel, you're going to have a bad time. So <laughs> if that's how you... If that's how you land, then yeah, your, your contraption is going to probably be the best for your piloting style. Because it's also... <laughs> I feel like it, there's some just... subtle shade in, in your... With your piloting style. <laughs> I... Maybe... Uh, not entirely intentional. I will say that I felt very, very proud of myself for how many landings I stuck on my flight deck. And it feels right when you when you land on that deck and just come to a stop. Because basically you you hit the ground while holding the brakes and it just... And it, it's like yep. being caught by a, a, an arrestor cable and it just it feels right. It yeah, feels break, like you're... Brakes stop you insanely quickly, don't they? Oh, yeah. I'm sure you'll probably do something about that too, because that seems like too much fun. Nah. Because all of the arrestor cable mods seem to be weird, so I was like, oh, I would like to use one, but it's, yeah. The one I used, I don't know which one it was, it seemed to work pretty well, but it was also only for a stream that lasted like two hours, so I don't know how its longevity works. Yeah, and, and how well it'll work on a server as well. I, it was on a dedicated server. Oh, it was? Yeah. Hmm. 
we were getting so much stone on the way to the magnesium. <laughs> does does the drill even reach the magnesium, or are you gonna? It have does. To it does. It, it 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 gets it gets into the magnesium. Okay, cool. Let me check and see our magnesium stores now. Where's this other assembler that someone's built? On the belly. Next to the car containers down there. Right. It should be in cooperative mode, but I... Yeah, it's not working. That's weird. And my stuff I'm... isn't getting ordered up properly. Well, we can take it off, if you want. Return to the days of a single assembler. Or we could just not use cooperative assemblers and... Yeah, Not each I, of us have a designated assembler. <laughs> I, I think we're better off with one assembler with maximum speed modules. Okay. Uh, it's just been... Oh, I, I should really empty this out before I do this. Oh, no, it's more fun if you empty it and it's like a piñata. <laughs> or piñata, as you would say from last stream. Sombrero. Sombrero? Yes. Yeah, it weirds people out when an Australian speaks with a... Can I look at the accent? It's just trip. correct pronunciation. Yeah. Like being in the part of the world that we are, not many people speak another language. Or at least not many people who didn't natively. Which is sad. Wish I could speak another language more than just a couple of random words of Spanish that I remember from when I traveled to Central America. I took four years of Spanish in high school and I was very close to becoming fluent and then I never did anything with it. Uh. And promptly forgot most of it. I can read it pretty well. Uh, speaking it is something entirely. Well, I mean, speaking is okay as long as I'm reading it from something. If someone, if a native speaker talks to me though, I'm like, ah, uh, yeah, uh, slow, please. I no understand. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think I think that's a common sensation. Uh, um, when I was 17, my family had the opportunity to go to Spain, and that was after my third year of Spanish, I think. And I, at, just for, for two weeks, you know, being surrounded by Spanish, I felt I was starting to understand things a little bit more, and I was very excited about the whole thing. Hmm. And then, you know, didn't do anything with it, so I lost it all. Yeah. I'm still kind of upset with that. And the, the frustrating thing is, like, my uh, my great-grandparents uh, were, uh, they were immigrants. Well, great-great, but the great-grandparents were fluent in Spanish. But because they wanted my grandmother to assimilate in the United States, they didn't teach her any Spanish. And because they didn't teach her any Spanish, I know no Spanish. Because if she had been taught Spanish, I guarantee you, my mom would have taught me the language as well. Because yeah. then it's, you know, this is passed down. I'm just like, ah, oh, I am so sad. It's uh, it's funny the different ways people have thought about that sort of stuff over the years. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's all different people, and all and every different person has a different uh, idea of what it means, you know, to move from one country to another. So, hmm. hmm. Am I making this too big? I really want to have a connector on this so that I can just fuel up tanks. And not uh, have to worry about ice. Because tanks I... fill up so much quicker and easier. And then I don't have to worry about weight either. Aren't those the it... tanks that explode? Mm hmm. Yeah. Just checking. Well, I think the engines explode too because they have hydrant in them. I'm not sure uh, about that. I don't well. know on that one. Uh, we can always test. It just looks like a standard splitsy truck right now. Uh, starting truck, yeah. Thanks, You're probably Thor. okay with that, with that profile. Um, you're gonna have to be kind of cheatsy with the wings if you want it to fit in here, unless you're gonna go folding wings with merge blocks. Uh, no, I've, I've managed wings that width, easy. Uh, you don't want them to be the width of the hangar. You want them to be like <laughs> yeah, no, it do need some wiggle floating room. right now. The uh, the hanger bars might need to get a bit of a bulge, I think. 
that would be wise. Hmm. I, uh, hmm. How, I mean, how attached are you to your craft? Because I think it'd be more fun if you tried to land on it as you built it. <laughs> well, it depends how big the wings end up being. Uh, we will see. We will see. I'm just going to keep going. Oh, there is a Mr. Amaru. Kapak wakes. Just in time to come in here and be like, Kapakchuli. Well, it means he can drive while I design, which is nice. Actually, I forgot what the password is. <laughs> All right. Uh, you know, it's it's pinned in our wrong way up chat. Oh, is it in the pin? And just, DE I just, just sent it, it yeah. to you as well. Okay. I'm a helper. <laughs> Thanks, Greg. <sighs> Refinery's choking on cobalt again. Why did they make cobalt so slow to refine? <laughs> yeah, Amabi, that's that's like I get it. Frustratingly for true. Silver Ugh. or for gold or platinum, but cobalt. Yeah, I don't know about. I don't know why cobalt's so slow. Because you can't rush, Steve. Ah. Hashtag blame Steve. Steve is my co-pilot. Cobalt to rest precisely when it means to. Oh, robot capac. Robot capac can talk really quickly. Uh... So capac, I'm glad you're here because I'm building a plane, which means the truck isn't moving. And it's night, yeah, so you can drive. Some move. Because nothing's ever gone wrong when you drive. This is true. arguably, you could say something went very right. Uh, I don't know. Hitting a tree on your landing instead of actually landing it—it's pretty wrong. Yeah, I'm not sure if you want to be the one casting shade about hitting trees, but say. Hey, when I hit trees, the trees go down. That tree did go down. Yeah, but not first. So did we. <laughs> so did we. <laughs> Thanks, Big Man Mike. <laughs> actually, actually, I just yeah. got a, an interesting suggestion in chat. Next time we make Capac Drive, make it a, well, a bomb. Huh? That way when he crashes, it's deliberate. Don't blow me up. Kamikaze Capac? Oh, I didn't even think about the fact that Capac could have to blow up in a bomb. Oh. That's my sleeping quarters. Got to be the noisiest part of the vehicle. <laughs> we figured it'd make you feel at home. Yeah. <laughs> you never woke up when I was streaming in the room next to your bedroom. I need one of those relaxing white noise generators. That's what the uh, that's what the refinery is. It just clunk. Yeah. Clunk 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 constantly. It's white noise. <laughs> uh oh, I see a buggy on the runway. Yep. That's the start of what might be a plane. It's gonna come back to the runway in my thirty minutes here, and we'll see if it's still a buggy or pieces of a buggy after that. Indeed. I always forget that the hydrogen engine is under the reactor. Thing on the, in the J menu. I'll just use my patented extendo bridge. The temptation to detach the rotor is so high right now. Or not the rotor, the piston head. Oh, have I touched down? I have. Uh, yes, I felt the whole thing <laughs> shake. As the well, piston bridge hit back. the other trailer. I think that's touch off rather than touch down. Yes. Uh. Uh, what is this vehicle going to be used for? It is going to be a scout, I guess. I might put some guns on it, but it's primarily going to be a scout initially. <laughs> well, let's make it a different color. Let's make it horrible yellow to start off with. 
I mean, I've got some, if you want a horrible color, I've got a few that I can give you. I think this is pretty horrible. I think it'd be better if you made it the mossy armor. Oh, oh there you go. Yeah. yeah, mossy is the worst. That color, but with the mossy armor skin. Oh, uh, yeah, it's going to look like a rotten banana. Ooh, oh, lovely. That is bad. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I think it's got moldy. Yeah, it's a moldy banana. Although, a moldy banana should probably be more this color. Well, I think you've already named your plane. That's a moldy banana. <laughs> I like it. Spotsy is flying a moldy banana. Well, uh, good thing I didn't have time for breakfast. Nab's given me instructions. Whatever you do, do not allow D to paint anything like the trashy bathroom. Uh, it's already, it's already done. It's already done. Is that is that referring painted. to something in your real life? Did you choose a horrible no, paint no, color no, in no, your no, house? No, 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 no. The tra so the trashy bathroom was a shuttle in one of our streams that uh. was painted with the black, but with the tile, the disco tile, uh -huh. and it, it was called the trashy bathroom. It did not last long. It was the Reavers didn't like it either, and so it was scattered across space. Seems reasonable. He paint a bathroom. Yeah, I can't imagine that uh, Nab would ever let you pick the color for something at home. I have an excellent sense of aesthetics. I didn't say aesthetics, I said color. They are related. <laughs> they can be related. They don't have to be, though. Oh, oh, man, everything's improved with shiny purple tiles. Just because you don't have good taste in color shades doesn't mean that my aesthetics are bad. Uh, is that going to be wide enough without being too wide? Yeah, I can go one more. Uh. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, now that's exactly what I was getting at. <laughs> What's your ooh wing, Kamak? I see a wing. Yes. I think you need one on both sides. Thanks. I was wondering what to do with the other side. I mean, I'd be down for you trying to fly it like that. It's probably flyable if you put enough gyros on it. I mean, yeah. it's Space Engineers. Everything's drivable or flyable with enough gyros on it. And also just add power. Hmm. More power. Uh, Clarkson yeah, School of Engineering. Doesn't even have any batteries on it yet. It does not. Because we're going to be flying with hydrogen, Capac, remember? Don't you need uh, at least we... like one battery? Yeah, I'll battery put a couple though? of tiny batteries on. Yeah. Because you need a starter motor. Whoa. You could just have, like, a hand crank at the front. If only there was a mod for that. That'd be <laughs> awesome. Well, there's the, there's the, um, uh, I think it's one, still one of Ixter's. Uh, the treadmill mod. I'm sure it could be modified to, like, be a hand crank on small grid. I've, you just put the Capac hamster on the treadmill and then you don't need a reactor. So, I'm curious as to, since you and Wasted have both tested this more, the impression I got and the way to kind of think about these wings is not in the create a low pressure, create a high pressure thing to create lift. It's more of a cut through the soup that is the air and in, with angles that should provide you an upward trajectory. Uh, so you it's... want the leading edge to be angled so that if the air particles were hitting it, that impact force would drive you upward if you imagine it that way. I know that's not actually what's happening, but it I, helped I, me get my head works. around it a bit. That works. Uh, you... I think also just having a... The, the best lift is having the, the angles pointing backwards, I believe. Uh, I'm, I didn't actually test this particular configuration because I found one that worked. Um, but it's lifting surface plus surface area 
and then kind of minus drag is kind of how how it works to be really really mm -hmm. basic about it uh, so if you have too much drag you need a lot more power to get something to fly if you have uh, too little surface hour area again a lot more power to generate enough lift so there's kind of a happy medium between weight drag and the, yeah. the lifting surfaces like what you've got here this should fly quite happily yeah and it was once I it was once I sort of thought about it in that different way that I went oh okay I think I've got I think I can make something that works maybe not well but works every time um rather than being like oh I don't know if this is even going to work at all Which is kind of how I felt at the start. Well, if that's how it works, it certainly explains why my horseshoe crab wouldn't take off. <laughs> Your horseshoe <laughs> yes, crab is actually cancelling out its own lift with how you built it. And generating downforce. Yes. Like, not just cancelling lift, it was genuinely sticking itself to the ground. What's the plan with this thing once it's built? Uh, attempt to land it. If able to land on this runway, then winner! I have a runway that works. If fail to land, then uh, rebuild it. And let D or Wasted design a better runway on here. Slash whatever Wasted's up to right now that might actually be adding an extra trailer. I'm not sure what he's Energy doing right now. Low. I think he's judging you. Is, is I am, yes. always buy. Uh, always yeah. buy your plane. Yeah, I was waiting for materials, minerals to process, and I was, was doing some running commentary with chat on the potential success chances of this aircraft. I mean, it's going to fly. <laughs> not just the potential success chances of this aircraft, but also a small discussion about how the way you're building it makes it impossible to build it properly. Yes, it's true. <laughs> because you've got it attached to something out the front, so those lift and drag... Sorry, the um, center of drag, center of mass are uh -huh. wrong. Yep. Yep, this I'm is sure true. Be fine. Um, I accept that I'm probably going to need to do some modification to this, modifications to this once welded up. Uh, which may involve complete redesign of the wings, but I'm going to go cocky and say it'll work, it'll be fine. Assuming yeah, I can at least make it symmetrical. Extra parts. Well, I mean, when I, I mean... Hmm? It'll probably get off the ground, yeah? Yeah. That's the important part. Briefly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just wondering if it's going to be... Uh, if it's going to fly... And look like flight, or it's going to well, be more like that car he was flying last time, where it's <laughs> you know flying at like a forty degree angle, desperately the, trying to stay in the air. With the wheels we've got, it's always going to look a bit like that. Yeah. To be I fair, mean, this runway is elevated enough that anything will uh, fly briefly when it leaves the end of the <laughs> runway. It's a fair point. Not wrong. I don't know. Um, I think you're going to need a, cap uh, a catapult off of this thing. I don't think you're going to be able to get enough speed to actually maintain flight. The lack of extra trailer was mostly because once we start building that, we're pretty much committed to finishing it. Ah, uh, okay. You see what I mean? It's like once I start welding a frame on the back of this, we have to finish it now. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's it is still dark, so why don't we just just check in the we're we're good with that commitment because yeah, I personally we aren't I going am... anywhere with the frame hanging off the back. I'm I'm okay with that commitment because if we're staying still, I can make the drill better and actually stick another piston and rotor on it so it can stow away. Yeah. Sounds like a plan. And Capac, you can uh, amuse yourself. Do Capac. Please. Oh, actually, no, we had a job for you. Capac, come up here. Uh... You're going to like this job. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good sign, right? What? Full of confidence. Oh. So see this, see this light chair? Yeah. It needs an umbrella. We were thinking uh, beach umbrella. Uh, and like, we decided that you would be the best at coming up with a paint job that looks like a beach umbrella. For the uh, acid it's rain. It's going to be large blocks though, right? No, it's small grid. But won't it get dissolved by acid rain? Yeah, but at uh, least then it's the umbrella getting dissolved rather than the chair, the antenna, the remote, the gyro, the light. 
I think armor does seem a little bit more resilient than the the stuff, just because, especially <clears throat> if you use heavy armor up top. Uh, okay. Umbrella. Got yeah. it. I mean, you could call it a sombrero, but uh, I was thinking... Uh, dang it, I can't remember the word for umbrella. Fuel I actually knew that word Oh, man. It's, it's been a minute. Oh. Dang it. I did actually know that. Uh, tortilla. Jeez. Uh, uh, you mean tortilla? Yeah. <laughs> From what yeah, we were saying last week. Same thing you use on the queasy dealers. Yep. Ah, I believe Charlie's about to be collected. Uh, let's see. Sombrilla. <laughs> Sombrilla. <laughs> Sombrilla. Ah, paraguas. That's it. Yep. Although I rolled yep, that right. R a bit much. Paraguas, um, yeah. Yeah. As in stop water. Oh, so that's what they named Paraguay after. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully nobody's watching from Paraguay. <laughs> uh, it's all right. You can... I mean, it's not like uh, Capac and I aren't afraid of saying bad things about where we came from. But that, that's not a bad thing. I mean, surely that's the same root for the word. It could be. Actually, it really could be. Yeah. I was, and I was all ready to make a Florida man joke. a bit of lag today. You are? Yeah. Yeah, your ping's 70. Wow, that's just unplayable. <laughs> Chat, give me some ideas about what color long I should actually paint before. this. Operation Is Space Better can, be, can take place because it's due next week. Operation is space better. Yes. Are you better off bouncing an internet signal up to satellites around the world in space oh. and then back down again? Ooh. Or are you better using a land cable? Have you... Are you getting Starlink? It's due next week. Oh. Interesting. Been waiting for... Had it on, like, beta pre-order sort of for about a year now. And yeah. Finally due to show up. And I'll be intrigued to see whether or not it makes any difference. Yeah. Technically, that was supposed to be one of the selling points, was the round trip was shortened by sending it up when you went far enough. Yeah. Light speed, yeah. some interesting suggestions about the recoloring of this plane because it's not stand at this this is hideous no it's it's the rotten banana you have to call it that now and leave it that color oh no it, it can still be called the rotten banana but it's just not going to be this color or i can at least do some details uh, let's start with this but do it in a mix of black and yellow so it looks more like a half rotten banana well that's why it's a moldy banana that's right, Moldy Banana, that's the name of it. Yeah, but it's still going to have bits of yellow on it. Yeah, well, now it does. It's got hazard yellow uh, back bits of the wings. Moldy Banana is still better than that Moldy Dark. Mm. True enough. Me a moment to pick up what you did with who you were throwing shade at then. 
that's because we've been playing something else out at the moment and there's a bit of role play involved and there's a bounty out on a man called moldy dark <laughs> <laughs> The nice thing about the using the aerodynamic drag mod rather than using the wings mod is it makes it very, very difficult to build something that's going to be capable or comfortably able to carry a turret. Even though I really wanted to add a rear gunner to this because I wanted to have my... You're not allowed to add a rear gunner unless it's a biplane. What it's if it's true. like a B-17 style plane? Oh, it's and gonna for be... cool factor. It, it, it's not going to be landing on a carrier if it's a B-17. Yeah, I know. Well, unless it's a foldy one. In which case it won't have any roll authority. I'm... I am biting all of my aviation <laughs> history stuff back right now. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be a good boy. Traffic, that is Hey, I said style, fabulous. not thing. What's, what, what's he done? Oh. It's oh. already fabulous. The fact that it's slightly offset up the yep. side instead of coming up the back. Yep. Jeff's kiss. Kavak, <laughs> there was a reason we all believed you were capable of this. <laughs> oh, it is beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Mm. Mm. I bet you he's going to use the panels in the middle, too. Paraguay, feather crown of waters. Paraguay being a feather crown. Oh. Well, to hey. huh. Apparently, or at least according to Wikipedia, which is probably correct. I'm also being told that I prob that I should stop adding extras and just see if the thing flies first. But I'm going to keep adding extras until it's daylight because I don't fancy trying to land in the dark. I tried that last week and it hard. Yep. It's nigh on impossible. Without a giant runway. The only issues I see you having currently is she's going to want a nosedive. Is it though? Otherwise, you've got quite a lot of wing surface. It is, but that's mostly to do with where your wings are in relation to... Because they're forward. Yeah. Yeah, I'm planning a tail section. That'll hopefully counteract some of that. Hopefully. Ah, but yeah, I, I just took a rough guess at where I'd need to start the wing based on the shape I was doing, and I wasn't confident that I got it right. I think it needed to be one block further back. At least. Mm. Um, come back. Remember, you do have the shapes, uh, these ones. Hang on. I think I know why uh, your uh, what the? assembly wasn't working earlier, Splitzy. Why is that? The main assembler was set to disassemble. Oh, I looked at the other one. I mustn't have looked at both of them. Or I did That's look right. at both of them and I glanced too quickly. Do you know where they well, are? Your somebody's changed it since then. Oh, yeah, you got it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there you go. It's the shape you want. At least for the top surface. Ah, <laughs> uh, thanks, Mandy. The colour is starting to grow on me a bit like foot rot. Wait. Once I crashed this, this is the second ship, second plane then become called Foot Rot? Jungle Foot? Yes. Yes. Wait. 
You know that if if you've made yours a moldy banana, then that means we can't keep any of the other planes in the same hangar because the <laughs> the enzymes will spread to the other ones and they'll all go the same. This is true. <laughs> he's he's not wrong about that. Uh, yep. Yep, can't keep them in. Oh, See, this is why it's good having Capac around when he doesn't have to talk all the time. You need enough time for your creativity. I wonder if this tail section needs to go further back. Possibly. Uh, yes, Tex, I did say this is why it's good around to have a capac around when he doesn't have to talk all yeah. the time. What? I thought I just refilled. Why am I out of hydrogen? Uh, did you refill your bottle or just your suit? I went to the med bay. I thought it filled up the hydrogen as well. No, we discussed this last week. That was a mod we had in Escape from Purgatory that we don't have here. Oh, so, right. Because I was meant to add it and I forgot. That's a good theme with Splutzy. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I do not have a retort. Actually, that's a good point, Hammerby. Capac probably does not remember last week. Uh, probably this doesn't is remember true. last night. Um, what did you eat for dinner last night, Capac? Can you remember? Uh, what did I eat for dinner? Hmm. I left my bottle of water behind. That's what I did. Um, right. Was it a special some... bottle? Is this why you're so upset? No, but I went, I got some food and I got a bottle of water to drink with my food and then I left it at the place that I bought it. Good job. Now yeah, I'm thirsty. Oh wait, you mean for your breakfast this morning? No. I mean, I, I didn't bring one today either, but... That's a different story. You're at the office, right? Yes. Thank you, chat. Uh, good point. I haven't added gyros yet. That would have been amusing. Ah, uh, chat saving him. Yeah. Chat likes to help me. And I'm very... Well, lucky. sometimes. Sometimes they like to help you. This, Remember, this, right? There's usually one or two people who really want to help. Yeah. Go to, I go back to look at what Wasted's up to. I see a projector up in the air and some wheel tracks going off into the distance. Uh, <laughs> no, you're all right. <laughs> <laughs> I've not just left. Tempting as that might be, no. <laughs> Low. 
mean, I, I for a second thought that one of your wheels might have left. Even if you no, didn't. No, that was the first stream. Now, I'm trying to decide. Do I do the the panel wings as my uh, vertical stabilizers? Because they worked reasonably well when I did that, but they look kind of ugly. I'm going to be using the plain part vertical stab every time. You still get a lot of slip with the uh, with using aerodynamics. Yeah, you do. And when you're landing on something like like this, Actually, you're going to want every bit of control you can have. In fact, have I even turned those things on? I think they default on, don't they? Nope. Oh yeah, there. Yep, I did it all. I did do right thing. Yay, right thing done did. Uh, there's one issue. They're real big. Not all of them. No, they're all at least five blocks long. So I'll put it lengthwise. Yeah, but then it's, then, it's, then, it's, then it's funny. Um, I oh. hate to break it to you, Splitsy, but the whole thing already looks funny. Well, yeah, but some of that was intentional. Sure. This bit's not. Mm. Maybe we can ask Capac to fold it into your design for you. Uh. Mm. Mm. Parachutes are for quitters. Hey, man. I'm going to chance it. I'm going with the stabilizers that will have slightly less fun made of me by waste. I won't make fun of you. I will just be quietly judging. <laughs> Same diff. <laughs> well, he, won't, he won't make fun of you in voice chat. Just watch his stream later and we'll see if it's true. Yeah, I've... I've not made the error of watching what Wasted says about me on his stream. <laughs> <laughs> I fear, I fear that that's down that path madness lies. Ah, it'll be all right. I don't say anything nasty. Not about you guys, at least. <laughs> I can. There probably is some stuff said occasionally, <laughs> but, but not about you guys. <laughs> I mean, I just think about the stuff you say about Shaq when he's not there. I say that stuff about him when he is there. Actually, that's a good point. That is true. I can just hear Capac spray painting up there. Is it making all the donking sounds, or is it just the, the whooshy sounds? Just the whooshy sounds, just the sounds that you would expect. At least it's not doing that painting glitch where everybody hears the, the donkey sound oh, when it like paints the, it and 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 that one. Oh, but I think it I think it is. It's just I'm the only one that can paint, and I'm not painting right now. Although, no, I can't paint my trailer making, for some reason. It's making those donkey noises for me as I paint these, as well as yeah. the Rishi sounds. No, oh, it's, it's uh, why the spray gun is the superior way of painting. Okay. What? New improved drill is working. Yay! Have, have we got cargo space for any more? Yeah, we are kind of full. I mean, we're probably not going to be able to move once oh, we I'm... try to, because the large cargo will probably get full. I'm not going to... Uh, I'm not going to drill right now, but it, it works now, and I'm going to get it all named and stow it away. Nice. Oops. That's something you hope not to hear from Capac too often. I just painted the wrong block. 
Uh, I think that's probably... Uh, I'm not forgetting about thrust, I just haven't decided where to put it yet. I mean, I could just take off with wheels, I just won't fly very far. <laughs> Thing has the almost the horrible colors of the Homer Simpson car. I wonder if it'll be as successful. All right, the old beach umbrella is complete. Oh. Oh wow. Very nicely done, Capac. <laughs> now he's painting the sand. You could do it in concrete texture. That'd look more sandy. Uh... I'm surprised you didn't do the post in white, though. It's not that usually in that white plasticky stuff. Oh, there we go. Dust. Oh, yeah. Dust looks good. No, really nice job, Capac. I like it. Oh, I'm about to run out of fuel again. <laughs> oh, no! Oof. There we go. That's a little less hideous than it was before. Ah. Excellent. It now wiggles constantly. I like it. Um looking for my tension right now. Uh, I think we've lost inertial tensor again. Oh, have we? At least I have. The light pole. Ah, oh, I've got it. Okay, if you could throw the inertial tensor on all those pistons. <laughs> or the appropriate ones, rather. I think all the, all the plunge pistons need it. This one on the side, maybe, maybe not. Actually, because it's above that, probably all of them. Not sure about the rotors. Should yeah, I tend not to do it on the rotors because sometimes they don't have the power to yeah. fight the fake weight. Oh no, I'm out of ammo. There we go. It's got a fair bit less jiggle now. Yay! Oh, that, that looks much better than it did before. <laughs> Waste, uh, it's got his projection going. We don't have any gravel? We don't? No, because it's all being thrown down the side. Oh, right, yeah, of course, we got oh, the ejector. I, we can turn that off if we need it. Yeah, we need it to make paint. Let's turn, the, let's turn that connector off. There we go. Should be collecting gravel now. Or you can go pick it up. There's a big pile of it on the side there. Uh, yep. Yeah. Uh, where was it getting... Uh, ejected? forward right side ah. of the trailer. Huh. Just realized something about this design. I could totally put a Gatling gun on the back if I'm ever in a dogfight. Like a Gatling turret? No, just a regular gun, just shoot backwards. Oh yeah, you're not gonna hit anything. No. <laughs> but it'd scare someone off, potentially. Maybe. I, I mean, like I'm probably the, uh... as likely to hit something with that. Whoa! That was loud. I like the <laughs> caution tape on the on the trailing edge. It, I, I don't know why, but I really like that. Yeah, it works weirdly. Like, it actually kind of doesn't look as horrible as it did before. Uh-huh. I think you can leave the paint color now. Uh-huh. It, it was just enough. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll need lights, too. Good point. Thanks, chat. 
It still has been zero days since the last accident, hasn't it? Well, yep, because we have one day per stream. <laughs> In the la in wrong way down, I had it so that we were um, yeah, every time it's just randomly really loud when Capac's painting. Oh, I'm I'm liking the uh, the effect there. It looks good. Yep. You preferred the concrete over the dusty Capac? Yeah. I'm a fan of the uh, this retro sci-fi right here. That's good. It's one of my favorite skins because it's shiny. Ah, uh, that's the beach. Yep. I uh, I like a Kavak. Um. An idea for you. You could create some sort of beach wash effect uh, with the plates. Oh yeah, beach towels, nice. Uh, so for those in chat wondering, the rules for the thrusters are thrust in one direction and no vectoring your thrust. I also think it's sort of gentleman's agreement that that direction is not allowed to be down. Yes, yes. <laughs> because cause if you you could essentially make a helicopter quite easily just by sticking the thrusters down and going, wee, off we go. Yes. Yeah. Uh, many of our rules are working on the gentleman's agreement side of things where we, we know what the intent of the rules were, so we just stick with that. I'm just hanging out on uh, one of these beach towels here. It's very relaxing. I feel like I'm on vacation. Oh. What? Uh, these are half blocks, and they're the wrong way around, so I can't put anything on top of them. Oh, of course, yeah, you won't be able I to. Gonna, I was going to put one of the dead engineers on the beach towel. <laughs> <laughs> you can put it underneath, I mean, as a uh, warning. Yeah. So creating a helicopter with thr using the thrusters, and also creating a helicopter trying to use the aerodynamics mod is not allowed and the aerodynamics mod is strongly not encouraged due to explosion when any of us have tried it ever. Mm -hmm. Some people better than me have been testing it. As far as we can tell, it's not possible. You can get something to lift off the ground with helicopter yep. blades, but all you're actually doing is using ground effect. Yeah. Yep. Are these trailery bits ready to be welded back here, Wasted? At least the, the bottom I am, part? I am holding off because the sun appears to be coming up. And same deal. Once we commit, the whole thing needs to be done. Whereas like like it is yeah. at the moment, that could be left. Yeah. You know, um, <laughs> that could just hang off the back. It's like a little rattlesnake um, tail. We've got enough resources. We should be able to build it relatively quickly, shouldn't we? In theory, yes. Yeah, let's do it. I mean, if we've got so much weight, we might need the extra trailer for the push. Okay. Um, which also means that I think I just gave DE permission to plunge his drill down to get more stuff. Oh, do you want me to plunge the drill? Yeah, did you want to? I, I can I can do that. Plunge! Uh, I need to figure out how I'm going to fuel this thing up. That's my next challenge. Got any gens on it? Uh, I didn't, but maybe I will. I put a connector on it, which I was going to figure out how to hook up to so I could just insta-fuel with uh, stockpile. Rather than using ice. So, I guess I could just use ice temporarily. Oh, I'm getting some wobbles, and I don't know why. You're getting what? 
I'm getting wobbles and I'm not sure why. Oh, it's the stupid drill. Stick uh, it in the ground and it'll stop wobbling. There you go. The tool shake is a little... Oh, was there one that wasn't inertia I, I share inertia tense at the second rotor. Ah. Yeah, that should be fine because it's just spinning. Yeah. <laughs> beacon for fun. Oh yeah, beacon. I need a beacon. All of our planes must have beacons. We need to be able to broadcast who's friendly and who's foe. I mean, the... Uh... Oh, I like it, Capac. That's a, that's a good color on that Gatling gun there. Ooh. Oh, the glitter looks better than the tile. Oh, boy. Capac's just... You're just painting everything, Capac. Just doing some detailing. Okay. Okay. For now. We're going to uh... pass through the magnesium as well, so we'll get a little bit more magnesium on the way through. I've upgraded from a uh, three, well, four drilled extension to a five drill extension, so there's going to be quite a bit of stone. Oh dear, did this you... is not where I want to be. Did you run out of hydrogen? I am in the hole underneath Hang the on. drill. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> there well, yes, is yes. I ran out of hydrogen you. on the second carriage and made the silly mistake of thinking I could jump from one to the another in the multiplayer. And the answer is no, no. I literally oh, wow. just ran straight off the edge. <laughs> no jump never, never, whatsoever. I've started uh, getting into the habit of carrying two bottles because I always forget. If I carry two bottles, I'll just use all two bottles up until I finally notice them. <laughs> and still yeah. be stuck down the bottom just with two bottles on me instead of one. Exactly what I would do. Oh. And build vision makes it so much easier. Build vision makes so much of everything easier. I think that there's, there's zero contest in my mind that that is my favorite mod. Yeah. Like, much Ever? as modular encounters add so much depth to the game with the combat, I, yeah, build vision. I don't think, yeah, I don't think I've, since using it the first time, I don't think I've ever loaded a world without it. It's just automatically in my worlds. Yeah. It's very convenient, but you can live without it. Whereas yes. if you were to take away... I don't think I play a save without aerodynamics turned on anymore. Without which, sorry? Without aerodynamics turned on anymore. Without the ability to make stuff with wings on it. Really? Mm, pretty much. Huh. I mean, you love playing around with... Uh, physics stuff. So that makes a lot of sense. Thank you, Tex. Uh, like, the two... The two mods that I would put on pretty much everything uh, would be Build Vision and Sneaky Sounds. Um, Sounds like some hardcore shilling. Yeah, it really does, but it's <laughs> also true. Like, it just... I, I hate not being able to hear other stuff when I go back and edit something. Alright, this isn't going to take long to fill at all. Excellent. Oh, we got an ore detector now. We've had one. We had one last week. It was one of the first things I did. It might have oh, even been the I first thing it. I did. Oh. <laughs> it's so observant. <laughs> also, why am I carrying coffee? Who wants coffee? Black. 
Oh no, it's Clan Cola. That's it, it was. Whoa. I mean, go boom. Alright, hydrogen tanks are almost half full. Uh, what about the engine? It's now full. See, I know Wasted and Tax have a slightly different opinion on this. I'm not sure about DE, but to me... Build and Repair would probably be the least important mod I've ever had a, I've ever played with. Because I may as well just go creative mode. Yeah. Uh, I liked it for very specific situations. But when you've got more than... When you've got two or three people in a world, you don't need Build and Repair at all. Even if you're trying to do something fast. Because you can just build something to build the thing. Yeah. And that's honestly what Space Engineers is about. Build and Repair kind of takes away a lot of the fun of the game for me. Same. Like, when I'm wanting to design something and just design, I will go into creative and I'll design it. Is the last carriage car going to be for hydrogen storage so you can keep the exploding tanks furthest away from the important areas? That's not a bad idea. But I suspect for now I'm probably going to have to put hydrogen storage under here, which at least has two roofs above it. And my only real problems with build and repair are it relies massively on your own self-control because you'll put one down and you're like, oh, that's fine, but now I want it to be faster. And how long is it before you've got a hundred build and repairs slowing yeah. the entire server down? And it's way too easy to weaponize. Yep. It's way too easy to turn build and repair into an incredibly effective weapon. Yeah, fly by the enemy Doomba. ship. Just fly by the enemy ship. Set your weapon set up to specifically, or your build and repair specifically to go for turrets first. Or cockpits first, and there you go. Just take the grid apart. I... Sorry, Lucas. I'm interested to see how the AI-enabled helpers play in that regard, because they're a physical ob they're a physically there, so they can be destroyed, and they cost something to make. So whether that balances people's desire to have something help them build, um, versus ruining the like kind of in my opinion, Damn. ruining some of the game. Like, will it be enough to make it balanced? So I think there's a chance it could be. Okay, we've got quite a bit of stone now. Do you want me to plunge again, or...? I will leave the decision re-plunging oh, to you. Oh, no, we don't need to plunge again. We've got 797,000 stone in one of the large cargo containers. We, we're not plunging again. Seems sensible. And there's nothing in the other one, so we're super heavy on that side, so I'm going to shift half of that over. Um, should I build a couple of baser refineries? I know they're less efficient, but just to chew up some of this stone. Thanks so much, Benjamin. I don't want to. I don't think we have room yet for a full refinery anywhere. An extra one. I mean, maybe, maybe if you can get them in with a sorter, so they only process the stone. I can do that. Because uh, the amount you get from the other stuff is so much less with the basics. Oh, has anyone taken a blueprint since Capac finished the beach roof? I'm going to bet no. Uh, so let's go 
Blam. Yeah. <laughs> Blueprint. Why did you blah? Because everything's jiggling about, so I'm crashing into things. Is that your excuse for being a bad flyer? That's my excuse for putting things in the wrong places when I'm trying to build. So I, th I think one of the things that the AI enabled adds to a helper situation is physical object, which means it can get destroyed. It means it also has cost per each of them you have. But also I I imagine you can't operate something like that very far from your own base. So using it offensively in the way that Wasted was saying is negated. Uh, Alright, time to drop this on the deck. Should we uh, rotate the runway for launch for you? Uh, yeah, it's almost sunrise. It took me just about the right length of time to build this thing. Do you want... Oh, you, okay, well, I'm rotating it very, very slowly. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I probably should have rotated it before I set it loose on the runway. We're rotating. Is that... Is that... Yeah, it's fine. Uh, there you the, go. Maybe the other way... Uh, no. I think you're going to want to be going... Oh, uh, yeah, I see. I see yeah, that's problem. uphill. <laughs> yes, the batteries Funny. are going to stay on recharge. That's the idea. I was thinking you wanted uphill a little bit, but th that's actually just going to throw you right into a hillside, which, yeah. while hilarious... <laughs> yeah, that sounds pretty good to me. Hilarious. I'm going to try and align it kind of with the river here. Yeah, as long as it's offset so I don't crash through into our base, then it's fine. Ah, I'll see, 900, that makes sense. That looks pretty good, D. Alright. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to stand right here. I'm going to turn my head off, and I'm going to get some popcorn. Yep. Popcorn. Steve has a good view of this. Um, I want a popcorn. For those wondering, I'm going to put Steve's perspectives together into a time lapse at some point. Uh, toggle. No. Handbrake on and off. Toggle on and off. Recharge on and off. Uh, then we have rusters. You have to do this like an actual pre-flight, though. <laughs> Moldy Who's banana thrusters. Tower? Who's going to be the tower? Cap, I you will be, be the, the tower. tower. All right, you have to ask for permission for the tower, for the tower to take off. So let's see. All right, I will when I am actually ready. <laughs> oh no! Just not, not yet. Facing the right way. I do see that uh, there are dead engineers, isn't dead engineer underneath Capac, <laughs> that's amazing. Hey, he's having a nap. Uh, Moldy Banana Tanks. I kind of like this name. It works. It does. It, it feels like a zebra monkey's name. Uh, stockpile on and off. Rename that so you can find it easier in future as well, okay, thanks. Oh, I'm just doing it manually. <laughs> thanks, Ego Kitten. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, I can't actually see the runway from here. Uh, I Ooh. need to get some lights on this thing because I haven't done that yet. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Anger! Oh, that's gonna die. Uh, that's dropped something. It was something. Was that, yep. that looks like a flying car. Uh, it looks like a flying... Uh, was flying something. I think something. it's a flying motorbike. Uh, yeah. I mean, I can only see one wheel. Yep. 
That's a can. that's a flying absconder. Oh, it's got a TFB <laughs> on it. <laughs> I, I, I recognize that vehicle. Oh, he's on the ground. I think he's dead now. Before we get attacked. I need lights. I didn't put lights on. I forgot the lights. You got the sun. You'll be Ow. fine. I think TFE might be dead now. <laughs> Ooh, that, that landed very true. close. Those bots, they just can't learn how to fly. Okay. Yep, this is a thing. This thing is going to fly so horribly. I'm looking forward to it. Me too. I'm glad we're in agreement, at least. Uh, right. Are we ready? I have my spectator cam lined up. <laughs> Whoa, why is the grid moving? The whole is grid, grid is now moving. Capac, did you start driving? I just landed on it. I didn't. I haven't touched anything. What's happening? Anything. What's happening? Why are we driving? Is the parking brake still on? Yeah. Huh. That should well, have been. We stopped moving. I'm glad your drill wasn't in the ground. I'm glad it wasn't either. Though I'm wondering if that many pistons might be contributing to some strange forces going on here. Uh. Good point, chat. I do need some ammo. We're also almost out of ammo. Could someone order some up? Please? Do you, do you need ammo for a test flight? Uh, we just got overflown by an aggressive plane. Do I All need right. ammo for a test flight? I don't think so. It's a test flight. You go up and you land real... You, you test it out and you come and land again real quick. Because... Mm. The argument here is, if you don't stick the landing, there's not going to be. We might not recover the ammo. We're not. We're not terrible for ammo, to be fair. It's just every time it gets made, it gets sucked up by the turrets. Hey guys, check out this sweet motorcycle. Because you I use the same the stuff as the. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, amazing. I. I'm just. I'm just amused that because Capac didn't realize that I designed that and they've stolen my blueprint. He just complimented me. Well, I mean, it's only working because I fixed it. <laughs> of course. It looks highly fixed. Yeah. It looks um, capac fixed. Yep. That's I'm stealing it. Ah. Huh? This uh, one's not mine. No more. Someone's missing their badger drill. You'll regret that later. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm taking this base box. Ah. Oh. Hey, I got a rainbow suit from it. Oh, nice. Alright, uh, everybody ready to watch me fly towards the assert operations outpost? Which we're going to have to detour around now, probably. Oh, I'm sure. so ready. Hey, split I'll try to remind you, but uh, request for next week. We have ultimate spectator. Oh, yeah. Uh, sure. Can you teach me how to use it? Because I know there's stuff I want to use with that, but I haven't learned. Yeah, no worries. <laughs> It's really it's good. It's pretty easy, yeah. Uh, there's a CLG beacon flying past. Uh, at very high speed. Yes. Anyway, uh, is everybody in their viewing positions? Yes. Yep. Okay. Launching in. Uh, come back. Permission to launch. Uh, sure. All right, permission to launch granted. One. Launching in five, four, three, two, one. Uh, oh, there he yeah. is. Why is the whole grid moving? Takeoff achieved. Oh, I really should have a should you have had wheels on. Somehow on. still in control of the main grid. Oh my gosh. I am. the cockpit. Yes. Oh, oh, that's uh, bad. I got it. I got it. I got it. That's Forget real bad. Grid. I tried to follow him on the motorcycle, but it instantly flipped. Um, let's see. Yeah. I'm oh, just still kind moving. of letting it slide back down. Turn off this programmable block. Well, I'm just letting it slide back down. I'm not you, You're good. He's in, he's in the seat. You're fine now. <laughs> okay. That would explain why my parking brake on this thing... Whoa, I'm getting shot at! 
I don't know by what. But I'm getting uh, shot at. Research base here, right over. Where is he? Oh, there's another signal coming down. Okay, we in a good position now. Feel like we're pretty secure. Oh, okay. I really need to turn these wheels off. Oh, that beacon's getting close. Looks like some kind of aeroplane. It does indeed. <sighs> okay. So, I'm in the main cockpit now, so hopefully that will avoid that whatever that was. I wonder if it's because you built it off of a rotor and it just never updated. Yeah, that was weird. Yeah, that will that'll almost certainly be it. Which is interesting because, um... Hmm. It shouldn't happen. <laughs> well, I'm controlling two grids at once, which means there is some way using a remote control and a programming script to pass command... Sorry, without a remote control, this as a way of passing player inputs from one grid to another with no physical connection between them whatsoever. Yes. Uh, Moldy Banana, you got CLG Beacon on your 12 o'clock high. Yeah, I've also got a weird pull to the side with this thing. Uh, yeah, I'd, I'd be less concerned about that and more concerned about the enemy airplane oh. that's coming right for you. Yep, seen. Seen. Almost a flipsy. Oh boy. Not quite. Yeah, almost. Oh, is this a dogfight happening? It could be. I think so. I'm, I'm in spectator, so we'll see. We'll see how fast I can get up to. Because I keep turning, like I keep randomly listing left or right. It's rolling when you're in the air. Well, it should no, no. balance out then. It's, it's like, uh, this is your. I'm getting your oh, it's left and right. Oh, that was a hit. Yeah. I see some pieces coming off. I scored a hit. <laughs> nice shot, Splitzy. This is really twitchy with my giant pros. Uh -oh. oh, yeah, more oh, hits. Another hit. You got another target coming in. CLG Absconda. I'm focused on this one. Don't get too focused. Incoming! Target fixation! Boom! Evade, evade! Evasive maneuvers! So, whoa! Almost a collision. <laughs> oh, is the beacon going down? Hard to tell. Alright, uh, I'm gonna try and evade and return home. It's RTB when you're in the, in the air. RTB. Whoa! Okay. Oh, man. I just watched a video about Whoa. all that kind of terminology the other day. Now all of it is gone from my head. Yeah, that'll oh, happen, Kamak. I did find out that, that bingo fuel doesn't mean no fuel. It means that you've only got enough fuel to return to base safely. Yes. Yes. I believe the correct terminology for when you don't have any fuel is, oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit. <laughs> uh, it's, uh, I believe it's eject, eject, eject. <laughs> Alright, what angle do I need to return on in order to land on my ridiculous runway? Uh, you need to fly oh. more in that direction and then come around. Uh -oh. Yeah, there are two bases in this direction. in a worse possible place for you to try and land this really We've got direction. incoming. We're actually in a valley. Yeah. Two enemy craft on approach from the north northeast. Where's my fire gun turret when we need it? Oh, I think the regular Gatlings are going to make pretty short work of this guy. Oh no! Yeah, but I don't get to laugh like a maniac while doing so. That's true. Oh no, I'm I mean, coming in for landing. Laugh. I'm coming in for landing. Oh, oh, well, well, the, there you go. I landed. Splitsy. I'm taking off again. <laughs> Where did you go? <laughs> I just hear this explosion. Right that wasn't me. You said I landed. Oh, that wasn't you? No, 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 I landed safely. Okay, there's a tree flying in the air. Is that you? Nope. No, he's over there. Over there being, oh, there uh, is. sort of east. Uh, graceful. Yep. Yeah, look at that. Yep, yep, it's not twitchy at all. Oh, oh, looking pretty good, looking pretty good. No, I'm not, no, I'm not, no, I'm not! Oh. Eject! Add power, add power, no! Oh! <laughs> all right. Uh, and he landed in his favorite uh -oh. spot. 
<laughs> a little bit short of the runway there. I damaged my engine. Whoa! Um, that wheel's spinning like crazy. Basically, guns are going nuts. It, yeah. Oh! I did a lot more than damage the engine. You're also missing lots of the middle bit. <laughs> the oh. filling has come out, one might say. Oh, that's excellent. Hmm. Just roll it back over with your gyros, you'll be alright. The squishy bit of the banana is gone. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Someone stepped on that. Oh, man. <laughs> Uh, it, it, you looked good, and I think you flared too hard a little too early, and so you lost lift. Yeah. Which is a lot easier to see from my spectator cam than it was from the pilot seat, so. I did the same thing the first couple times I tried to land something. Uh, now you'll have to redesign it into a rectangle and call it the banana bread. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I, I, I think this is going to need to be scrapped and reprinted. Uh, sure really? about that? I think you can flip it. Just flip it, throw it, everything back in. Alright. We'll try. We'll try. We we can solve this. We just need another 15 rotors. Oh, yeah. Maybe a piston in there. Just one more. There's something over there that's angry. I'm going to go check it out. Uh, it's whatever's left of that plane, I think. Heading off to the woods by myself. Nope. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. Nope. I'll come along too. Okay, Mick, do you have a drill? Uh, yeah. Okay, good. I just have bad experience going to the hills without a drill. That's not physics. <laughs> <laughs> I know physics when I see it. That's not <laughs> physics. That's physics with an F and two Zs. Yep. So, fitting of this then oh wow oh, oh, hey look sound. there's a robo corpse yep what's on the robo corpse uh, he's got some paint oh that's important huh oh. Oh. i mean it it turned over wow oh, this oh, is oh. a pretty pretty big plane now i have a paint gun oh and they are using the skids which sometimes work oh yeah i had a lot of trouble with that when i was yeah well, free stuff. <laughs> Thanks, Dragnon. Uh, yes, I caught it. <laughs> yes, upside down, Miss Jane. The, Is uh, anybody else getting like 24 frames a second? Yeah, every once in a while, yeah. Yep. I'm okay right now. But... Uh, I, I, I've got a, the heady heights of 46 right now. Let's remove some of these observation outposts. <laughs> I just have a feeling there might be quite a lot out there. Yes, there are. There's also a lot of small grids out there. Well, well you mean pieces of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's a, there's yeah. a flipped motorcycle. Oh, is this any better for anyone? 88. So, yes. Locked at 60. I thought they put occlusion culling into this game. Oh, it's definitely there. Hmm. And it works just as well as everything else Keen's designed. Uh, like, I can't see anything, but it's definitely having a dramatic effect on frame rates. Yeah. And you're on a 2070 right, or a 2080 right now, right? Uh, 1080. Oh, this is a 1080. No, I, I, I'm a sensible person that has the better graphics card in the stream rig because reasons. Ah. Yeah. I've been thinking about that. Uh, it's not good reasons, Blitzy. Don't, don't, don't think that those reasons are solid ones. <laughs> well, I've been thinking about moving it from my... So I've got a another good graphics card that I've got in my computer that I call Steve that records the time lapses and mm -hmm. potentially moving it to my stream rig. If your stream rig's not running the new NVENC, it'll be worth it. AKA if it's got a 10 series or older. Yeah, it's got a 1080. And if you've got a 20 series or newer, you can replace it with, you will notice it in stream quality. Oh. What? Oh, there's there? another, another flyby. There are pieces falling off the bad guy. Oh, yeah. It's it's down. I always uh, like it when that happens. Yeah. Oh, there's a path here. 
Can we... I'm going to add a beacon to our main grid. Because that'll make it easier to find when we need to come back to land. I'm coming. Ow! I got shot. You dead? <laughs> I've fallen down a hill. <laughs> yes. Alright. Let's follow Cap back into battle. I guess. One banana, two banana, three banana, floor, four. I think Sp Splitsy smashed four it banana. hard into the floor. Hmm. All right, Capac, I'm behind you. What the? Um, they have death ray vision. Be aware. The robot just looked at me and I died. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was some kind of latency thing. Neat upgrade. When do I get that? Yeah. <laughs> I want lasers from my eyes. Come on. Holding out on me for Did you get him, Capac? Not sure. I think so. I had hit him a couple times before I got death raid. Do they okay. have any ammo aboard? There's a warhead. Uh, uh-oh. Is it beeping? It will be in a sec. There we go. What the? Why are there large grid blocks falling from the sky? Huh? I don't know. It's mo must be one of those weather conditions. Oh, right. Of course. Hmm. Actually, this aircraft is almost... Like, recoverable. Well, uh, I'll leave one of you two to try that. I have to recover my own. I don't know, Capac, you want to recover this with me or should we just scrap it? Um, I'm full. I'm heading back to drop off stuff. All right, scrap it. it is. There was, in fact, ammunition <laughs> in it. But how do we the chance of large blocks? Yep. This exploded because of my tanks. That didn't seem to take out much Maybe. else. I would have thought that if the hydrogen tanks exploded, it would have been like the um, original jalopy explosion. Totally and utterly devastating. How... Do you guys have one? Or how many tanks do you have? Three. How full were they? Because it is a function of how full they are. Hmm, pretty full. I'd barely been flying. Uh, maybe you just got super lucky then. Apparently so. I will say I got some pretty great footage of you taking pieces off that plane in that dogfight. <laughs> that was that was quite fun. Yeah, that was. I cool. think we're going to enjoy that. Well, I think you and Capac will enjoy it. I don't think I'll be able to hit anything. I didn't think I'd be able to hit anything either. I suspect most of chat didn't think I would be able to hit anything as well. Well, you did hit the ground quite well. Okay, that I suspected they would think I would hit. Yeah, that ground never saw that coming. <laughs> yes, drunk look, Capac. Look, it's all black and blue. You bruised it. All right, I'm just going to go for a hydrogen and O2H2 gen on this time rather than the cargo container. So wasted with this, are we just building the, the lower frame here and avoiding all the other stuff? On the uh, neutral. With the exception of one arm, I've almost got it to the point where I can just turn the blueprint off, so give me two seconds. Okay. Be way easier to see that way. Oops. I'm going to adjust my uh, vertical stabilizers. This thing's so wonky, I'm going to have to go cheat mode. You know, that's going to be ugly. Yes, I figured chat would agree with my earlier statements of my own ineptitude. Oh, 
actually. Get rid of this connector if I'm going to go on O2H2 gen. Once I make sure other things are connecting these things together. Hmm. There's a Callisto and a Bubbly Bertha headed this way. Well, hopefully none of them get in range. That's asking if we're going to take anything to space. No, we're not, because we're not going to space. Well, I mean, we sort of might. Also, connection problem. Hmm. Is anyone else having an issue? Oh dear, am I having an issue. I think I'm having an issue. The server is, though. Oh. Yep. The server's having a real problem. Hang on. Uh, this is problematic. Uh, yes. It's actually my server that's down. Or was. Uh, hang on. Weird. I didn't lose my remote desktop connection to it, though. I do appear... ...to have possibly lost my TeamSpeak server, so one sec. Hopefully we can get some uh, voice chat going. Hello. Hello. Yes, yeah, uh, appear to have lost TeamSpeak. No, you two lost TeamSpeak. Oh, just us two. Just you two, yeah. Oh, all the TeamSpeak <laughs> went down for us as well. Yeah. Yeah, TeamSpeak's down and... Oh! Uh, the server's back up. Yeah, I got the password prompt. Uh, um, so it looks like I'm joining back in again now. Yeah. Uh, mine refuses to connect. Let me exit my game. The TeamSpeak server is still down. Yeah, I'm mm. just my rebooting it now and seeing if it'll fix. I need to get to a hard line. Wasted and I are back up in TeamSpeak. Cool. All right. Uh, I still can't connect. Uh, mine's attempting to connect. Yeah, mine's saying failed to connect to the server. Um, the, are you still talking to Wasted? Uh, we got disconnected for a little bit, but we're in the same chat now. He's on there again. Hang on, I gotta switch um, Because we... Yeah, I can hear him. We're talking in the TeamSpeak server now. Um, right. You guys dropped out yeah. of the TeamSpeak server. It said connection lost. Yeah, it was weird. I wonder if something happened on the Australian end of things. That was very, very odd. I mean, that's the wrong way up for the internet, for sure. <laughs> it, it, it is. Uh, why can I not connect to the TeamSpeak server, even though it's you guys can? I cannot. Uh, let's see if I can connect to the regular server. 
saying joining world. Uh, where's the server physically located? Sydney. I'm joining the world. Hmm? Um, perhaps maybe Sydney's been either... wiped. Oh, no, I'm in. Either... Hey, nuked. I'm back. Nuked Cows by the control. Russians. Wow, that was real weird. Lost everything for a sec. That is strange. Although Capek is still on a call by himself on Discord. Yeah, he'll do that. I'll see how long he knows. Just, <laughs> just leave him there for a bit. Uh, right. Well, I'm back. We're back. It's all good. Uh, Capac will Did discover what's wrong soon, I'm sure. Yep, he just left there. He'll be irate that we left him, but that's funny. Did the... So it looks like the server just crashed hard or something? No, this is the thing. The server didn't... It seems like the SE server crashed or lost connection to Steam. Oh, and Capac's still, still can't not team speak. Uh, do we want to try a different team speak uh, server? He'll need to restart his team speak. And then it should be good. Should be all fine after that, because that's what I had to do. You're back. There you go. That was exciting. It was something. I don't know that exciting is the term I would use. Oh no, these these NPCs have disrupted our connections. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Colouring on these wing parts it leaves something to be desired compared to the defaults. Mm. Hello. Yeah, that was really odd. Like, I went to my remote server manager thing and it was like, yeah, everything's fine. Except Steam's crap. Steam's lost connection, but everything else is fine. Like, I could connect to it. Weird. Real weird. I know I've had crashes so hard before in Space Engineers that it disconnected me from the network so something there yeah weird thing is though i was still streaming so i didn't lose my internet my stream never uh, dropped <laughs> yeah but the uh maybe the the server client right i don't know because you were showing me i don't know uh -huh. that's weird that's weird that was a real weird bug it was almost like australia lost connection to the rest of it well australia is not real so it's just a myth. Yeah. It's like dry land. Yeah. Well, especially since Australia is mostly dry land. Makes sense. Right, I need to grab some ice and then I'll be ready to take off. Yeah, it might have been steam dropping or Australia steam dropping in Australia that was the issue. But then I was surprised we lost. We shouldn't have lost um, TeamSpeak then. Yeah, that's the weird part. Real weird. Real, real weird. Well, I'm just, I'm just glad it all came back up because that would have been a real short stream. <laughs> yeah, that would have been real disappointing. I mean, at least I did crash my plane at some point, so you know we got yeah, what we were it after. Short it was dog sweet. fight. Yeah. It was a dog fight. A plane crashed. Some building was done. There we go. Done. Over. Bye. <laughs> now wasted. We'll stream for twelve hours doing more building and testing. Yes. <laughs> With all that as mere prelude. Alright. So what's the plan for this next trailer? What's it actually gonna be? I believe it's gonna be one of the folding flight decks, question mark. Mm. Are we not are we not doing that, Jara? Uh no, I don't think it's a particularly good idea. Okay. That was just accidentally welded up from the old blueprint. Having gyros on the back sections, it's not like anyone can control them anyway. Right. The all they're doing sure is interfering. Yeah, Although sure there is a subgrid gyro control script. I wonder who wrote that. Yeah, I wonder who too. It wasn't me. <laughs> good point, Capac. Good point. Thanks, thanks, Capac. <laughs> Easier to I'd help. I'd be worried for a second, but. 
Yeah, we're especially uh, my... not welding that up, do you? Because I've been wondering where all the steel plates have been going, and now I found out into that yep. gyro. What the... I just figured I'd get the I'd get that thing done first. Like, I thought there was a what? reason for it. Who just what? played the dramatic music? That's probably on your end. Uh, there's a CLG beacon 500 meters away. Is that it? No, that's the crash plane. Um, I'm gonna take off again. Wish me luck. A good luck. Do we have Here to? We... Hey. All right, so who's building the next plane? Well, I, I mean, have to wait until we have the next uh, flight deck. Kavak, are you going to build a runway at any point? Surely we don't need a runway each. Yeah, that's what I'm suggesting is maybe we want to figure out a way that we can share the first one, the two of us. I've just decided how to do my runway. That was the answer. Thank you. Sharing uh, it with Capac? No. <laughs> no, taking inspiration from Capac and the series title. Uh, a runway that you can launch off from both the top no, and no. bottom side? A, a runway that you're Coming in for to, landing. You, you aim to land on upside down because the runway is upside down. It is, in fact, the runway. Coming in for up. landing. Oh. oh, no. Yeah. Oh, oh wow. I thought you were going to catch the edge there. Well wow. done. I, I, I didn't think this was a VTOL. <laughs> so, well, uh, it's more vertical landing. Yeah, that was more of a drop than a <laughs> runway landing. I, I, have you seen a carrier landing? They're, <laughs> they're pretty rough like that. Yeah! It feels good, doesn't it? Doesn't it feel good? <laughs> you pleased with yourself, please. <laughs> Yes. Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> Sudden slight jock moment there. <laughs> Bro fists all round. <laughs> uh. <sighs> oh, man. I can't believe I landed on such a small spot. I basically I don't need a runway. Honest. There you uh, go, you heard him. Splitsy is disavowing runways. He doesn't need them anymore. I said basically don't need them, but I didn't say that I didn't need them. I will need to make some way of locking this down, though. Well, of driving. I did have an idea for that. We could put, like... We could put, like, an arm. Or, like, grab it. Yes. Somewhere. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I, I think considering our pings, we should probably have to work with the harder conditions. Uh, so we probably should share this runway. Uh, also, I'm going to ban the spammer in chat. Yeah, get him. Oh, text beat me to it. <laughs> Quick Ooh, fire. Run runway's a bit dinged up. Is it? Oh, did he dent it a little bit when he landed? Ah, uh, it's not too much. Just a couple of... nicks and scratches. Oh, Whoa. I should really turn off the... thrusters before t going forward on the runway. Oh, yeah, that you're gonna want a, a button on that. Yep. Yep. Uh, my solution was to put, uh... mag pads on the bottom and just drive over them, get out, and then lock it down with a button. Because then it shouldn't do the this can be controlled by somewhere else, hopefully. Ah. Uh. If it does, uh, then you're gonna have to put a mag pad on your plane and just like run it into one of the bumpers. Let's just run into a capac first. Ow! My face bones. Those were extra bones. You didn't need them. You weren't using them. Yay! Right. Okay, Capac. Uh, oh. I remember how we did a launching thing. system that we tested? Yes. Could that also be our parking system? Uh, what? Well, you were talking about an arm. Could it yeah. not do both? Um. 
I mean, we we could try, I guess. Oh, this will... Can only try. Well, if you want to work on that, I can start... Building your plane? Making myself a plane, yeah. Alright. Okay, uh, brain, think how to do this. How many points of articulation am I going to need? Hmm. Also, how close are you to your... Oh, your trailer's almost done. All right. Uh, should probably help ways to finish this first, and then I'll think about this arm while I'm doing it. We are making slow, steady progress. I think we might want to have a go at resetting that script as well, because it looks very much like right at the moment every wheel that gets welded on the back is trying to um, mm -hmm. go places. I Sounds suspect like... it's got propulsion override stuck on. Yeah. Which chews through your power, annoyingly. Just flip the block off and on. I think you might have to recompile and then run. And possibly park the front. I don't know. Wasted, what have you found you need to do for that? What was that? Sorry. Uh, what do you need to do to reset the script so that it doesn't do this? What have you found works? Uh, turn the script off. Select all the wheels, right click on the bar, oh, propulsion right. override so it resets itself, and then script back on again. To do the prop do it proper manual. Yeah, unfortunately it's, it's the only safe way of doing it. I think those were they ended up with it jammed on during the uh Oh my god, it's driving itself shenanigans. <laughs> yeah. Uh yeah, text, maybe something like that work. So I'm thinking uh, once we can get this thing down on the ground um, perhaps moving forward would be a good idea. And trying to find a bit better space for us to all launch our planes from and test. There you go. I think all the wheels are done. Yep. Okay, so to stop the script, how do I do that? No! Script of wheels. I'll just grab more. Okay. Should we'll be good now. Look at that. Should? Huh? Some are still spinning. Yeah. Unless that's just visual on my end. No, they're spinning on my end too. I suspect everything's got a little bit of an override, but I did actually just reset it, and then as soon as I turned the script back on, it did it. So let's do it again. Should we turn it off and then let it fall, and then let it go down, and then try? They are spinning again. Are they off? They should be off now. So they may just be passively spinning at this point. That's possible, yeah. Just free spinning. Yeah, they're free spinning. And did you test that by running into it with your face? Uh, no. Oh, that's usually my testing method. Uh, no. Although with the wheels, it doesn't really stop them. With everything else, like uh, rotor and base, The it inner does. wheels are still spinning. I don't think those are free spinning. The inner wheels are still just going. Huh. Oh well. Uh, when waste is ready, you can lower that anyway. Just in case it's turning off the links at the moment, the rotor etc is all on. But yeah, if you want it, if you want it down, you just turn them off. All right. Wham. Don't forget to turn the other two as well. <laughs> Ow! What did what you happened? do? I just jumped from the trailer to the rover and died. <laughs> <laughs> Did you miss? 
No, you didn't. No, I landed on it. Oh, <laughs> uh, well done, Capac. Um, so, are people ready for us to try and make some uh, headway? Yeah, that was timing. Is that someone's drop pod? No, I think. No. CLG beacon just blew up. Is that are they dropping stuff on us? It looks like. I think they're dropping stuff so our turrets don't acquire them. Ooh. Some of those got close-ish. Like the one that wasn't... They, there was one that wasn't targeted. Yeah, that one. Those are warheads. Are they? We should move. There, there was yep. a warhead on that other thing. I think these are bombing runs. Uh, Kidoki, mm -hmm. since bombing runs, let's move. Is everybody uh, anchored down? You're going to want to fiddle the wheels a little bit and probably get your runway, etc. around to being vaguely straight. Nah, it'll be fine. Uh, it might actually be safer this way. Oh, uh... Well, Kappa. it makes your vehicle a lot wider. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Kappa, can you hop in the cockpit of my plane? Uh... You're going to need to stay in there for the moment. Huh? Why? Uh, because... Oh, no. That, wrong way, wrong way. Spin the other way. We want the tall end at the back. Yeah, otherwise we will run into it. <laughs> yeah. Good enough. Yep. And Capac, you're just in the cockpit so that if you start shifting, you can readjust your position. Uh, I'm just going to wait right. for Wasted to do wheel adjustments because I'm going to break stuff if I do. Wait, Capac isn't locked down? No. What? If his parking brakes are on, he should be okay for the most part. Unless I bounce. Yeah, when has a space engineer vehicle ever bounced? Good point. Landing gear time. <laughs> yep. Good point. Well made. Okay, Capac, I'm going to whack a landing gear on the front of this thing and then you just drive it to a wall. Oh, sweet. I can do that. Uh, Capac, do you want to get out of the cockpit? For it. <laughs> Thank you. I, I don't want to miss my opportunity to drive your plane into a wall, though. Yeah, that's why I asked you to get out of the cockpit. I'm going to put it on the rear, actually. I was just going to put a mag plate on the wall and just snap into that. Okay. Although that Run might be the too wall, far back. back. I think that's too far back. Kappa, can you drive the plane forward a bit, please? Into the wall. Oh, actually, wait yes. a sec, wait a sec, wait a sec. Don't move, don't move. There you go. Drive forward until that one locks. It's a temporary solution. Or let me do it if you are. Yeah, he's working on his job. There you go. He's locked. locked. Alright. Cool. Now you don't need to be in the seat. Okay. Now everybody ready? Wasted uh, the wheels ready? Uh, probably not. I'm not, sorry, I was having a quick look at seeing if I could find a way of magplating this runway down. Technically, um, if we put some magplates on top of the cargo containers, yeah, you might be able work. to get it to do it. I'm just, just a thought. I haven't adjusted the wheels. I need a place to sit. Uh, you know what? So do we Give me two seconds and I'll be ready. Hmm. The hell? I suppose I did build a lot of it. You can also just uh, lock the rotor. That might be enough. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Which means that I can do this and you can't do anything about it. Do what? Oh, I just realized he can paint. I am the controller of the grid now. Yep. <laughs> I've I've lost my ability to paint the main grid. It's because it's owned by me now. I can still paint the front, though. What? Yeah, apparently they're, like, considered separate yep. bits somehow. Like, I can't even oh, paint unless my... unless you got into a cockpit, and then definitely not. Yeah, I can't... I can't even paint the, um... My own runway. I don't know if you own it or if someone else does, but I can't paint it. Demo. Ah, uh, but let me know when I can drive off. Almost done. I want to. I'm just putting a flight seat down on the back so that should we end up in that position, it can be driven backwards. Yep. And so I've got a seat to sit. 
something I like about this multi-vehicle design that um, you've come up with and we've done is that when we eventually go to try and get to the other planet they get pulled. yeah and try it with one piece first okay that looks more interesting now the purple actually stands out Also, at some point, I'm going to have to undo the fact that the tech side doesn't match the DE side. Oh, you're never going to be able to undo that. <laughs> Fuel. I, I may have done that on purpose just to get under Texas skin. I remember. Fuel critical. I knew you did it. I just wasn't 100% sure it was on purpose. I'm, I'm saving my, my big Tex maneuver. Which is next time he's missing on Vanguard, I'm gonna get Abby on to do his role. Oh no! Do his best, <laughs> do his best Texan accent. Just pretend like Tex is there all along. Oh dear. <laughs> this is um quite, quite the southern accent. That's gonna be amazing. I can't wait. Uh, don't worry, we haven't forgotten the script. I've got it on the hotbar of the main cockpit. Which I guess at some point shouldn't be exposed. I'm sure it'll be fine. What could possibly go wrong? Who knows? It's us. We'll find a way. Oh, yep. There goes Wasted adjusting the suspensions. Mm-hmm. That looks kind of cool, as it just went... Whoop. Just needed a little bit of extra. Uh, right. It's a starting point. The steering's probably going to be a bit odd, but we can start here. Uh, so this is the steering we've got. We've still got steering uh, on yes, those I need. Wheels. I need to turn the steering off on the back. Yeah. Texfire said it's not a southern accent, it's an abomination. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'd be looking forward to that one. Let me get you a nice center line here for you, Splitzy. Don't don't worry, I'll help you find the middle. There you go, that should be all of them. Good to go. Uh yep, looks good. Alright. Fucking break off. He said it looks good, you guys heard him. And we're on the move. So many trees. I have to bulldoze through all of these trees. He sounds so upset. <laughs> yeah, oh. ow! Ah, I'm in a bush. <laughs> uh, are you breaking things? There's a lot uh, of shooting happening. I mean, we're shooting that plane that crashed up ahead. Yeah. Oh, nice cap. I'm going with the, uh, the even symmetry. We just, yeah, I thought I'd mix it up a bit. We're just playing some farming sim, plowing some fields. Mm -hmm. uh. Well, those cows aren't going to plow themselves. It is definitely an interesting perspective walking around on the grid as it's being driven. Yeah, it is one of the really cool things about Space Engineers, that we can do that. Because there are so few I'm games not... that allow you that ability. Yeah. I'm, I'm not sure this was the optimal path to take. It was the only path to take. Ah, okay. I'm slightly wedged, though. So I've managed to get the middle trailer off the... Ah, there we go. Got enough tilt, I think. Ooh, yeah, they were, now we're moving. Oh! Oh, that doesn't look oh. good. Uh, this is quite the angle you've discovered. <laughs> mm hmm. Oh, no. 
Yeah. Be, any any time you end up in a slightly old position like that, you are frequently better off using the re like letting hitting reverse and letting the rear trailer pull you out of the problem. If you know what I mean. Yeah. If need be, because there's multiple of us as well. Oh, jeez, that came close. Hi. That actually looks pretty recoverable. Is it somebody still on it though? No. Uh, you know, it was the shadow of another one over us, though. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> oh man, they're just falling out of the sky. Uh, Sorry, thanks, Mickey Man. Thanks, robots everywhere. Uh, uh, something's taking damage. So many people in chat keep telling me to add the tree harvesting mod, but I don't see any benefit to it. The uh, critical damage we sustained there were two uh, two damaged lights. Uh, has someone taken control of this grid from me? Negative. Wasted. A connected ship has taken control. Capac. I'm shooting planes with my gun. Um, hang on. I'm gonna try grinding down your plane's cockpit and see if that. No, it's it. fine. It's fine. I got control again. Okay. I'll put my grinder. It's multiplayer away. weirdness. Let oh. me know. If or when you want the rear propulsion back on again. Planes coming Off back at around. The moment. Well, I've kind of gotten us stuck because those the middle trailer is too heavy around the containers. Because the containers aren't actually balanced over the wheels, they're forward heavy. Is that mm -hmm. out? So I kinda need I need a lot more power on the front if you can give it to me. Go! Oh, just keep I keep seeing shadows fly over us. It's okay, our turrets will take care of them, as long as we have the ammunition. Hang on. Yeah, I've... Yeah, we're stuck. Pull! I'm pulling! Eve, Spitzley! Eve! Pulling as hard as I can and it's not doing anything! Let me give you... Alright. I thought we were doing some clay pigeons. You got trailer three wheels again now. Alright, I'm gonna try and reverse. I'm producing some nope. ammo because I'm Jack like knifing! Bad, wrong. Uh, we're moving. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The um, middle trailer is stuck on a nodule of rock. Forward yes. right wheel. Yes. <laughs> Thanks, Calvin. I don't think any ah. teaching will help me. Uh, if you increase the strength of that wheel, I don't know if it's already been increased, but it looks oh. like it's fully, uh, fully compressed. Ooh, there's not a lot left of that airplane. Nope. That got a bit too close. Giving you a bit of extra strength. I feel like the Did only way for me to out of here is forward. This point, it is. is uh, we just need to clear that right hand wheel because it is just that one wheel that's stuck. Alright. Do we drill? It's not, it's not even turning. Should I drill in front of it? Yeah, you might as well. Collision messages that are supposedly spherical. Wheels do get stuck quite a lot. Hmm. Well, they they're, they're those spheres with corners, you see. Not all spheres in games have... Don't all spheres in games have corners? Well, I'm a flat uh, wheeler myself. That might be enough. I'm getting some weird voxel interactions because of my ping. I'm not getting any drilling sounds at all. Yeah. I can hear you drilling. Like I, I can see it deleting the voxels, but I can't. I can't hear the you know the ting 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 when you you know you've actually interacted with it. It's not confirming that. Oh. There we go. <gasps> oh. <laughs> oh. That doesn't feel good. Oh. Uh, also, yeah, drone inbound. that wheel. Distress call. Hold up. Let me get some more voxel out of the way. Hang on. Dumb as this might sound, you want to jump out for a sec, Splits? Yep. You're going to try and pull from the back? That was my thinking, yeah. Uh, yeah. you're off the ground with most of your wheels in the back. I figured. I don't have steering either. Um, Because <laughs> I turned it off. Can you, uh, grind off that wheel? 
I'm I not think sure it that's might be idea. in the voxel. Not on the voxel, but in the voxel. All right, grinding it off. Oh, oh, Ooh. we're Ooh. moving. Get some more strength from that bit. Oh, bits are raining on us. Actually, I think more than that might be in the voxel now. Well, remember, wheels have bizarre collisions, the uh, suspensions. No, the, I think then I wonder if we're doing that thing, like, you know how the server load was a bit high before? I wonder if we're doing that thing where we're sinking through. Um, I can walk through the wheel or the suspension here. Yeah, yeah, suspensions don't have any collision. I'm talking about, I think oh, some the of the wheel wheels here. are oh. sinking into the ground. Yeah, it does look like that here. Yeah. I think Let me try... We... Ow. No Ow! I just almost killed myself on another turret. Alright. Um... I'm detaching the back bit. That's yep. right. Okay. Uh, I suppose I should get in the driver's seat then. Ah. Yes, that's probably something I need to, to remember. <laughs> power. Put power on the bit you're going to detach. Oh, yeah, that's right. We didn't put... Yeah, I got a battery coming. Oh. <sighs> Can't go. Yeah, I mean, I think most of the issue, I'm not even sure if it's sinking into the train, it's just try to do something kind of impossible. You're trying to pull a wheel into a space where there isn't room for a wheel. Yeah. I mean, we could drill a trench through there, it might work. D, can you tell me which large container is on the right hand side? Uh, large cargo container two. Okay. You're going to try and push all the weight to the other side? Yes. I have done, and it didn't work. <laughs> I put all of the stuff in the other container, and it's done nothing. What How about? do I get vehicles wedged like this? I don't understand. Wasted was driving this thing like crazy, and he never got this badly stuck. What if we put a piston right here? I just here. get it upside down sometimes. <laughs> yeah. What if we put a piston right here, lift this bit off the ground, just get it out unwedged, and then maybe that'll pull, we can pull enough with the front to then drag it over this hill just to get that the next set of wheels to have purchase. You think in piston skate? Uh, I mean, it'll it'll skate for a little bit, but... Just if you take to the piston head off, off, it'll skate quite nicely. Yeah, yeah that's Actually, what I was yeah, we can do thinking. So, Did you ever try the like piston skate with large grid wasted? No, only ever with small grid. Yeah. I don't think it's quite as effective on large grid, but I think it still sort of works. Unable to place. Oh, there we go. I mean, I could... Yeah, I guess I could take the front off and try and reverse back and then reconnect to the middle trailer at a different angle and see if I can get a better purchase and better pull. I just worry if I disconnect, I'll never reconnect. Well, that's fun. What's that? The refinery isn't pulling stone from the subgrids. Oh, really? I'm having to manually move it explain why we've got so much stone. Oh, that felt good. That did something. Uh, it popped up a little bit. I think we might need a little bit more purchase. Oh, 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 oh! I'm hearing lots of banging noises. Yeah, I'm driving over a plane right now. Oh, I think we're doing good. We're doing good. I think Wasted's about to try and race ahead of me. Or already has. Where'd he go? Where did Wasted go? Let me get rid of this plane because it's acting like a chalk. 
Bye, I'll see you on the other planet. <laughs> oh, there you are. Yep. This waste bit. <laughs> I was just. Did you stop moving the wheels for a second? Oh, okay. You scared to be down there while I'm driving? Well, I'm. This plane's acting like a chalk. Yeah, I'm scared <laughs> I to know. be up here while you're driving. And now as I'm grinding off, it's sliding further underneath the wing. Of course. <laughs> uh, yeah, Kai, I guess it is sort of a model engines thing. <laughs> Thanks, Kyle. <laughs> yes, not a creepy sticker. Uh, am I clear to you? Uh, give it a shot. Looks like... Oh. Oh. <laughs> there goes that plane. There we go. Oh. Okay. Oh. That's a lot of banging noises. <laughs> it's alright, I'm driving over <laughs> another plane. Too much fun. <laughs> I, I might okay. be having a lot okay. of fun with that. Okay, hang on, hang on. I'm hang gonna on. add that wheel back. Let Stop. me just get somewhere a bit flatter so I don't lose my uh, momentum. It, okay. It feels pretty flat here. Also, Wasted's doing a mono. I love it. <laughs> also, as it turns out, the uh, piston skid works on large grid. Oh, you should see the shenanigans that are happening on my screen. So right now, the, uh, the runway and the wheels are level with each other, <laughs> and the middle grid is bouncing everywhere. Ah, we're good. We got clear. We didn't have to use copy-paste. Adding the wheel back. This also makes me think that um, we could do with adding another hitch to the front car. Oh yeah, that's a good Just idea. Just in case you ever need to reconfigure and I move around with the back to the front and pull you out. <laughs> oh, I like that thinking. Should I pull this? I, I gotta pull this piston off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it'll die in the next acid rainstorm. Ah, uh, probably not all the way. Pistons are tough. Oh uh, yeah, but it'll fall off because we didn't weld up the armor. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, if it, with any luck, it'll happen while we're moving. So then we just get to run over the piston. <laughs> oh, cat back! I love the biplane. That's good. Uh, I think we might have left the ice area and we've run out of it. What? Well, that was good timing. We have no ice. Take your plane up. Find some more ice. Well, it's right behind us. I guess I could circle around a bit, but we're not usually known for go going back backwards. I don't want to go back through there again. <laughs> <laughs> or if we mm. go through there, maybe wasted drive so he doesn't get us stuck. All right, fine. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> that the latency is um interesting. <laughs> uh, Press forward half a second later, actually goes forward. Yep. I mean, I have a little practice driving these. I could try. If we, I mean, honestly, it wouldn't be too bad if we attach the rear one back and just drive it straight backwards from the rear. Yeah, I'm thinking we, yeah, wasted, reattach, and just drive us backwards. I was just getting the reattachment bit done. Well, that'd be helping line up. That'd be handy. Uh, how would you like help? You're actually pretty good. Just a little bit further back. Alright. There we go. Attached. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was... Like that professional. Was impressive. That was amazing. <laughs> what the hell, man? How? Who... Who are we and who's replaced us? What have we done with the real us? Oh... Uh, hmm. That's a Maybe good we've sound. got uh, W4573D-D. Maybe that's why it's so good. Ah, uh, it's possible. Why uh, the disappointment no noises, Capac? Uh, I just had an amazing idea, but it won't work because I've made because uh, I've got an even symmetry, not an odd symmetry. I mean, you can just have it stick out one side. It'll be fine. Mm, no, I can't. So it trim, real dumb. So it right, I am still work. utterly paranoid about pressing the P key. Yes. Ooh, there is another one. I don't use is the P key. Is there anything actually on this grid that 
is connected on, because I don't think there Would is. Would you like me to release the handbrakes? I could do, but I'm trying you to... You know, you I'm could add that to, to your the on that thing. There was, but I've just turned off the user parking. Handbrakes are off. Okay. Here we go. Yep. If we got steering on or off, hang on, hang on. Oh, uh, what's happening? What's happening is I don't have steering. <laughs> the and the front other end does. does. <laughs> Here, I'll fact, turn the steering on like, these wheels. Looks like no end. Oh, no, but both, end, both ends don't have steering, perhaps. Uh, we are putting this script through its paces, aren't we? Yes. All right, I'm getting all of the wheels on the front bit, and I will turn off this steering. This should be first trailer wheels. Should be a thing. But it should be a group that works, but whether it's still a group that works, I don't know. Steering is off. <laughs> I'm getting some frame drops again. Oh, dear. Uh, I'll do some cleanup. Uh, Capac Mandy's suggesting that you try and make a palm tree for the beach. Ooh. Good <laughs> idea. Yeah, Miggy. Uh, <laughs> Hasted got that very, very nicely. Thanks, man. And thanks, Mandy. Thanks so much, Matthew. I hope you have as much fun as we're having right now. Uh, let me do some cleanup. Doop, 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 doop. Doop, doop, doop. Is that the cleanup song? That some is the cleanup yep. song. Is doop, it doop, possible doop. to sing the cleanup song from somewhere that isn't the main cockpit? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> uh, apologies to the bots for deleting your grids. That had to happen. Ah, who's driving? Just have to make sure Where I don't accidentally delete Capac's plane. Capac, can you name your plane? Uh, uh yeah, yeah I can't drive this. Uh, let me try. The latency delay. The only way I could drive this is if I was driving it from a completely independent grid that doesn't have any wheels on it. Huh. As in, so all of the script, so the script is controlling every wheel, so that all of the commands arrive at the same time. Ah, uh, yeah. Because as it currently stands, with my latency, they're not, and that means that the rear end is going faster than the front. <laughs> Maybe you can yeah, script, turn the script off. The script off picks and... up the input first, somehow. Maybe if you just turn it off, just drag the whole thing back with this. Wow, there are a lot it's of tricks all over around. Uh, let's just turn clean. Uh, I don't like clean up because then it deletes stuff we actually want. Or oh, we just have splitsy driver from this end. Or capac, since they have the latency. I don't know if... Uh... Uh... Ooh. Is Only about... Everyone got their frame rate back? Yeah, thank you. Okay, I will drive. Capac's building. See if it has the same effect for you, but yeah, for me. It's, yes. Yeah, it does. Yep. Yeah. Whoa, what's going on here? It's ca oh, catching. Woo! Two of the wheels are over the top of each other. Yes. I can reverse from here. It does not like to drive from here. Weird. Might have to turn off the script and just pull with this. Yeah. It's pretty straight. Oh, the jiggle is real. No, it's dancing a little bit. Actually, even... I think they It hitch. still doesn't like it, does it? Yeah. Even just pulling. It doesn't want to do it. All right, I'll have to do a Yui. Huh. Uh, I deleted one of the bot's planes by accident. Well, they're not going to like that. They're no, they're probably not. Revenge. <laughs> But there's so many small grids out there, I couldn't help it. Uh, so we got to fix up the wheels again. Right, so what do I need? I need some of these. I need those. These. Send the an apology. I'll send them a gift basket of warheads. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, an assortment of fruit warheads. Um, I'm not sure Yui's going to work very well here. 
Well, we're going to find out. All right. Uh, have we turned off steering on the back? I've turned on steering on the front. Let me see. I'm going to have to get... Oh, wait, it's here. He'll do no, I'm noticing other weird discrepancies, like air shock being off on one bit of the grid for some reason. Oh, huh. God. Does the script just need to be recompiled again? No, Maybe. I think that's more likely someone hitting the wrong thing in the control panel because it's right next ah. to allow parking brake. Steering's off. Okay. Away we roll. Swing wide. Yep, that's so weird that the main grid of the second trailer um, is bouncing around. Have some of the hinges been turned on on the hitch? The front hitch? I haven't looked, I don't think so. Off. Okay. Off. Just sort of behaving like I was getting that resistance. Off. No, the resistance is coming from the fact I think that your wheels are not turning in the right direction at the moment. Oh, this is so janky. It's working, though. Yep. The only warning I would give you is you don't want to ever end up in a position where... <laughs> the front and the back front. look like they're going the same direction? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, definitely would and not want to do a U-turn this tight with uh, more trailers. Definitely not. Yes, yes, the script does not like that. That's when you get a banana split. So does anyone notice that the um, the runway is kind of... slowly rotating. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Cool. Yep, I'm facing a different way than I was before. Yep, erasing all progress made today. Uh, okay, Dee, <laughs> you've got your um, you got your mini drill ready. Mini drill? I can get the mini drill. Yeah, hang on, let me get yeah, there. Mini I'm just putting the, the runway kind better of back drill. a little bit. Saying that, we're probably going to need... I mean, you need to have enough room to UE again. Mm. Going down Good on the point. mini drill. So we might as well go back further to that big open ice space. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, you know, literally to where we started. Yep. <laughs> And the drill is down, so don't move. Okay, noted. Thanks so much, Peter. Uh, yep. Wide turns necessary. Must go ultra wide. Fellas. Drill's coming back up. Give it just a little bit. Oh. Jackie. You should be able to move forward now. Mm. Oh, I can almost scrape if you'd left. If you can leave it, just. Oh, I can. I can do that. Yeah, if you... I'll tell you when to stop it. Oh, good battery. Um, so you kind of want it so it's hovering above the ice surface, but still collecting some. So about... Yeah, that should be good. There you we go. Should, we should get some while I'm finding a space to turn around in. And having a bit of a... What? Okay, Space Engine is not happy. And my graphics driver has crashed. Oh. So Delightful. No thing. <laughs> uh. Yep, Miggy. I guess we wait for you to reconnect. <laughs> yeah, as apparently I'm the only one who can drive. I mean, Capac could drive. I mean, I can I can pull you out of the cockpit and give it a give it a whirl. All right, I'm in the cockpit as well, aren't I? Yeah, whirl him, whirl him. <laughs> I think I have to. But we haven't built the whirling jig yet. Uh, here we go. I'll be back in in a sec. Uh, it uh like space engineers driving. is updating. That's concern. Oh, that's not good at all. I, I have. Hope a that's just a update. mod. That's probably a mod. Yeah. Yeah. So we want to go to this big space through here. Thank you, Tina. Wait, did you kick me out of my seat? 
Yes, I did. Jack. Progress must go f must go forward. Also, welcome to the route we could have taken if we didn't want to get stuck. <laughs> Everyone's a critic. But what we need is a uh, man with a scout plane. All right. Yeah. Well, if the game would let me back in. <laughs> well, you're definitely disconnected. Um, it could be that it thinks you're still connected. Do you want me to murder you? Because no, 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 I no, no. Could, it's I not even letting that. me try to connect to the server. Um, if Splinty's not driving, then who's driving? It's Steve. Steve's driving. Okay, that's right. Then. <laughs> it's actually handling pretty well for me. Just remember, if you drive it, you take all the blame. Oh, I'm fully ready to take the blame. People are already blaming me for uh, Capac driving the the car off the cliff because apparently I told him to do it. Yeah, because um, when Capac does something, um, it's never my fault. Easy. So pull yes. a Yui around here in this big bit. I think so. Yeah, should have should have plenty of room there. Uh, is the server giving me any reason why I'm not connecting? There we go. That's better. Now it's working. Ooh, slippy. Server host has left the game. This is not good. Uh, did you try... Oh, no, you've already tried restarting Space Engineers. What about uh, doing a Steam reset? Killing Steam and turning it back on? Uh, not yet. I'm just going to try one more. Reconnect. There we go. Oh, looks. I can see you connecting now. There we go. Connecting. Loading. All good. It's like a scene from 2001, The Space Odyssey. How slowly this thing has to turn around. Yep. Actually, to be fair, it doesn't have to slow down or turn around that slowly. I'm just doing it so... Why are you turning it. around? Because we're going to be going back the other way at some point. Oh. I Might as you... well get that done now. Yeah. I thought you had to... I, I don't know where you've gotten to. But I was aiming for... There was a wider bit of the lake that I thought would be turn, useful yep, to turn I've around. Already, I've already oh, turned already us there. around on that part. We're facing mostly the correct direction now. I'm going to go back to my ice drill where I belong. Oh, yeah, I probably should have been watching Steve's perspective. He can see what's going on. I'm back. Okay, drill's going down into the dirt here. Into Yay, the ice. Yeah, I'm back. Grr. Hang on. What the? What? Okay, we should be able to move forward in just a little bit. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So how much ice have we picked up now? I did not check. You're clear to move forward. Uh, we've got 40,000... Something like... Okay, we got we got a lot of ice now. I think we're good. How much do we have? <laughs> we've, we've got something like 300,000. Yep. Uh, I think that'll do. are really good on ice for whatever reason. All right, let's make some forward progress. So this third trailer is going to be the flippy, spinny launch deck, yeah? Mm hmm. Thanks, Fred. <laughs> yes. I haven't thought that far, Ed. Ah, uh, see, Miggy Man Mike's got it. D is the little devil on Capac's shoulder who pushed the other guy off. <laughs> Me? I would never... I 
going to get to the weird... We're going real fast, Blitzy. Yeah, it is a little fast. Uh, it's really not. It's like 15 meters a second. Mm, feels pretty fast to me. Yeah. We, we hit, on my screen, we hit like 26. Mine, mine still says 15, like when I looked, when you said it. Hmm. Well, we're doomed. <laughs> that really does dominate the sky, doesn't it? Uh, it really does now. <laughs> See someone's unknown signal off in the future there. Or future distance. Oh no! Bye, DE! And his life flashed before his eyes. <laughs> yeah, are you alive down there or are you just bouncing? Uh, the wheels, the wheels missed me. Oh, good. The, for whatever reason, the the aft trailer seems to be the most stable for me, so I'm just going to stay back here. Yeah, it's real weird which subgrids are weird. Oh, whoa! That was a bit rough. Yeah. Uh, the weird one is the one that's essentially connected to multiple lines. Yep. It's got the runway on top of it, and it's connected to the at the back and the front. Yeah. And with their aerodynamics having extra forces, it makes it even weirder. Also, Aero prepare for collision. Large grid. Yep, this is just vanilla space engineer's weirdness. Ooh. More collisions coming. Can you hear the glee in his voice Whoa. as he imagines destroying these trees and then gets to? Ow! That almost killed me. <laughs> I'm like playing Frogger back here, dodging the tree so I don't get knocked off again. Kafak's daring to grind at the moment. Yeah, I'm trying and to I'm get just my plane done. Enjoying a little drink on the beach? <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Oh wow, the uh, the runway actually super stable for me as well. Yeah, the runway stays all rock solid. It's only the grid underneath. <laughs> yeah, you see it that too, it's like bouncing all over the place. Yep, I am seeing that as well. But not the wheels. The wheels are rock solid. They know where they are. They're on the ground. <laughs> oh, I'm so worried that one of these tree corpses is just going to wipe out my plane. <laughs> <laughs> You're locked to the grid still, though, right? Yeah. Yeah, don't worry about it. You'll be fine. Uh, okay, it looks like we're going to have to get into some rough terrain, regardless of what I do oh. ahead of us. That doesn't look fun. Uh-oh. Oh well, they're gone now. <laughs> Did you drop something on the ground, Kavak? Yep. <laughs> this doesn't look so uh -oh. bad. Oh, balloons falling directly above. Oh! Uh, it's, it's doing a contrail at us. We we can't we can't launch our ready aircraft because there's another aircraft in the way. Yep. That is true. Oh, Kavak, you need to ready your craft. He's too far forward. Ooh. I'm sure he could survive the landing if he just hops off the edge of the runway. I don't. Oh, we got another one above. Oh. A small airplane. Turrets are on, yes? Uh, I believe so. Alright, uh, I think I've run out of nice ways to go. Uh, we just need to scout out a path. Are you saying stop? Probably? Alright, handbrakes are on. Uh, so that means we need to launch a plane. Yes. Oh, you're already rotating the runway. Where I am on the beach, right looks to be a good option, but uh, mm -hmm. obviously we can confirm that. Well, Capac's going to launch first, so he'll make sure the way is clear. Is that yeah. about right? Yeah, that's about right. All right, so D, you wanted to be driver. I believe you might need to take over the driving position. Okay. Oh, uh... Oh, 
Oh, that doesn't look right. I'm going to have to change that. I wonder if I can reverse off and survive it. Maybe? Feels unlikely though, doesn't it? It does. <laughs> uh, Fred just suggested we need a mod for every 10 or 50 trees destroyed you get something that attacks you <laughs> that could be oh if someone ever made that that could totally be used in the next series we do like this Kavak you ready to launch yet? nope you ready to drive yet? uh I guess because we can make a temporary little parking area off to the side to get you out of the way so I can get up in the air Uh, yeah. Or you could um, try and get off to one side and then I could probably get past you and then you could get behind me and then I just have a short takeoff. Because uh, I think my... Oh, what? no, our wings a are connected the same ship has taken control. It's because you got a landing gear. If you want to fix that, you need to take and uh, actually well, finish your landing gear. I don't <laughs> want to detach the landing gear until I know that the brakes are on. I just uh, press P, it'll be one. fine. Has anyone seen what Capac's trying to do here? He's trying to detach the landing gear. No, have you looked closely at his plane? Wasted? Mm -hmm. I, I, I believe they're just decorative. No, he doesn't have anything that pushes. I haven't built the thrusters yet. Okay. <laughs> okay, as long as they're just decorative. Uh, I mean, it's still probably going to be weird, but... I do like them. And actually, if you put the uh, the engines directly behind, it'll almost look like it's a full engine to sell. Yeah, that's true. Oh, the thrusters are too long, though. <laughs> uh, take out that middle, that middle pylon bit and scoot it Ooh. forward by one. Yes, okay. Yeah, because you could put um, you could put a beam I, in like this. I guess I could put them in like uh, like on the sides, like that. Yeah, that's another option. Do How are you nice planning on fueling this, Capac? Uh, I've got access to cargo. Have you got an O2H2 gen? Uh, no. <laughs> so I ask again, how are you planning on fueling this? Uh, I, I say, don't know. I say we have him <laughs> move it off to the side. Hang on, hang on, I've yep. got an idea. Just temporarily. Wasted dancing in through. a corner. Is it not going to let me place it? Hmm. Wait. <laughs> These are just temporary over here. No need for that. I was I was gonna try and dance on your head, but I couldn't get myself to stay up there. Hey, okay, Capac, just drive your plane off to the side over here. Yep. Be real split. My PC doesn't know where my character is. Your PC's not gonna have a chance. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> also, I did just drive off the back a little bit. Uh, right, drive. Wait, are we getting sim speed drops? No. Oh, jeez, Cap, I almost ran me over. Okay. Alrighty. And go. Runway is clear for takeoff ish. Let's just angle a little bit off to the side there. Hopefully, I don't clip the lights. Uh, launching in three, two, one. Oh, he just cool. ducks the wing. Ooh. <laughs> It'd help if I put the thrusters on, wouldn't it? <laughs> well, <laughs> that was a thing that happened. I, I safely landed it, though. Well done. <laughs> Try again. There we go. Arm up. 
I can see okay. the giant planet that we are heading toward. Uh, Capac, do you want to pull back here and then connect back to this this pad back here, and then we can take that off and we can actually be mobile again if we need to be? Alright. Uh, uh, sure. I'm just I thinking need... in case we need to drive. I think for this scout plane, I need a passenger seat so they can look while I focus on the steering. <laughs> while you focus on the whole staying in this guy, but yeah. Uh, Baloo's yeah. Folly's pretty close. Shoot it down, Splitsy, shoot it down. What's what's close? Huh? Baloo's Folly. All right, I need to turn off. I... All right, I'll go after it. It's also the research base ahead. Uh, Tom Cruiser Scout Rover. Uh, I see two of them, and there's a PAV coming in. Yep, PAV's overhead. Uh, there's a research base that Baloo's Folly is close to, so I don't really want to go close to that, and uh, you take attack. Out, then. Uh, there's multiple Tom Cruiser Scout Rovers coming in. Baloo's Folly is on your tail. Our turrets are on Baloo's Folly. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Uh, whoa, oh dear. Oh dear. Uh, let's see. That's yeah, not I'm a okay. improved maneuver. Also, did I really not remove the bits on the back of this thing? Oh no, I put bits on the back of it to put a landing gear on, and then we stuck it to the thing, and I didn't take the bits off just because I knew it would annoy you later. Uh huh. And oh no! Possibly question whoa. your sanity. Oh. Get them, turn. They haven't hit me yet. Our turrets are hitting them. Yeah, as long as I fly close to the base, <laughs> I, I'm, I'm a flying decoy. That scout rover's 900 meters out. All right, I'm gonna try and go after it. Uh, be forewarned, strafing runs are very, very difficult. Yeah, I need more altitude. Or less altitude, I just drive. Ah, uh, it's cheating. Oh. oh boy. Oh, I got I some hit. hits! Nice. And I didn't crash! Well, also, done. I'm about to be out of fuel. Uh, land? Uh, that's not an option. That's not an option. Gain altitude, glide back in. You'll be fine. No, nope, that's not an option. You're out of fuel now. Right. Oh, oh I landed it though. Yes. Well done. I'm getting closer to the top. Oh no, I'm getting shot rover. at. Looks like Blue's Follies on you. I'm in route on foot. But, oh, uh, I think one of them just crashed near me. That excellent. looked like a wingtip that was way too close to the ground. Okay, I think I got it. I am now running on my two tiny batteries. Where's the base? That's the way the base. I need some ice. Uh, the Tom Cruiser Scout Rover is upside down. Oh. You didn't use uh, a spectator to find that, did you? No. Good. <laughs> I'm right next to it. Uh, oh, also, it's between me and the base, so I'm going to have to take a detour. Because every time I accelerate... Oh, no. There's another one. Every time I accelerate, I um, run out of power. And my thrusters are off. Uh-oh. I'm having a heck of a time kill th killing this robot because of the latency. <laughs> Incoming fighters! Oh! Oh, I saw that one go down. We got enemy troops on the ground. Scraping my wings. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. 700 meters away. 
No! Oh, no, now it's raining. Oh, it better not be acid rain. If it is, I'm dead. Uh, I think it's just regular rain. Oh! Okay, I lost a little bit of my wing. How are you guys holding up? Uh, oh. there's nothing... Nothing here, really. Okay. I've almost made it back. I did make... Did take one of the wheels of that rover as a trophy. <laughs> I'm back! I'm at the back of the trailer. Okay, now land. Uh, I need fuel first. Just jump real high. <laughs> Here, I've, I've been there, done that, and failed that. Uh, that's, that's how I lost the twin stick shooter. Oh, really? Yeah. I was trying to get onto the big rover and I uh, destroyed myself. I wish you could have grids pull hydrogen out of the hydrogen bottles. So. <laughs> you used, I don't know if it still works, but you used to be able to get oxygen into cockpits that way. Uh, yeah, it does still work. I mean, someone's uh, tried to put a little bit of ice in your in your doodad here. Yeah, getting some ice. Uh, where's the cargo access? Uh, the cockpit. Are the guns? Cockpit, all the guns. Oh yeah. Uh, cool. All right, I should be able to get back up in the air now. Okay. Are you riding on the wing? Sure. It worked well last time, didn't it? Yeah. It worked real well. I'll actually ride up here. It'll be fine. Oh! On the ground! Oh, that's a waste. You almost ran. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say you almost ran him. <laughs> I'm so sorry, wasted. <laughs> See? Blitzy is the team killiest team killer out of anybody in this group. Oh, wasted. I can't believe that happened. Again, waste, uh, again, Splitzy, I have watched you gun down someone or vehicle down <laughs> someone right in front of me with no provocation. <laughs> I forgot my thrusters were on and I accelerated too quickly. Oh, mm. my goodness. Can right. confirm. Wings substitute very nicely as a blade. <laughs> His wings are actually just high enough. If you crouch, they'll go over you. Not if you're not expecting it. Whoa. Just calmly Goodness running Christ. around, just minding your own business. Well, that worked. Yeah. <laughs> this is definitely... You know, you don't need a second cockpit. You just need somebody riding up here. All right, let's go scout this uh, scout rover. Oh, oh. The, the, up, the upside down scout rover. Oh, is it upside down? Yeah, that remember I told you it was upside down, and I took a wheel off of it. Oh, okay, it's that one. All right, the Tom Cruiser scout rover. I see. All right, D, you're, since you're a wing rider, you should be dancing. Don't. Oh, hearing gunfire. Taking fire. There's a butt down there. Yeah, I just fired a few morale bullets at him. Right, I was going to be dancing, but you're banking real steep and it's making me nervous. <laughs> oh, there I go. Oh, oh, see ya. Hang on. I might be able to get back on. Ha, made it. Ah, oh, well done. Oh no, oh, that, this is that was a mistake, that was a mistake, that was a mistake! Oh, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up! Full thrust, full thrust! <laughs> oh! I was in first person during that. Oh yeah, don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but I need to for the um, attack runs. So otherwise I have no idea where my guns are going to hit. Oh man. That, I was watching the trees get taller and taller and above the wings. I'm like, this is not going to end well. <laughs> oh, it looks like if we can get through these 
couple next nasty bits, we should have some okay terrain. Yeah. Until the mountain. Yeah, but we might need the mountain. Yeah, maybe. I mean, these smaller bumps, I'm not too worried about. Yeah, some of them are the nasty, real nasty though. Is there yeah, the ones that are like real steep. Sorry, I'm wondering if my weight's affecting you. I'm just to say real <laughs> close to the center line. No, I I think every now and then it just lags a little bit and the controls go wonky because I'm having to stabilize this a little bit. Morbid ah, okay. Krim in my chat says it's nice change to have Splitzy responsible for the death of someone other than Capac. <laughs> Please, I'm mostly responsible for my own death, and you're mostly oh. responsible for yours. Uh, speaking of responsible for deaths, there's uh, quite a few enemies around the rover. All right. Oh, there's somebody up in the sky above it. Think you take him on? There is. Oh yeah. yeah. See, right up there. All right. Wing gunner. Oh uh, yeah, we'll see. I'll just scare him a little bit, spook him. Uh, bear in mind, unexpected. Uh, Maneuvers yeah. may happen. I am, I am ready on the jetpack button. My dampeners are set to your uh, your grid. Does that count as using, com using them in combat just to get back? No, on? I think it's fine. <laughs> okay. Given what I'm doing to you. Uh oh, what the? In range. Uh, it looks like Pav's fallen through the world. I see him four kilometers underneath me. Got him! Uh, also, what? we're dropping like a stone. What on earth is happening? Oh, bounced! Oh. Tree! What happened? Oh, that hurt. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, no, my thrust overrides are still on. <sighs> okay, what happened? I think he just wiped out our lift by ramming us. Uh, uh yeah, and I lost my guns. Guns are gone, uh, but I think that's everything that's gone. Guns yeah. and light. Alright. You should be okay. Let's go back, but back to base then. RTB. I got a few good hits on him before we... I did. Have, I think I took yeah. out his cockpit before he hit us. I, I think you did. I And I was I was just looking down the sides going, oh! <laughs> I've got some good footage of that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. The stupid stuff you can do in Space Engineers. This is fantastic. Yep. Anyone Ooh. want a Tom Cruise or Scout Rover? Uh, the one that's I mean, minus a wheel? Um, doesn't look mine as a wheel to me. Oh, oh must be I a second. to be driving it just fine. Oh, there is another one. Oh, there's another airplane. Oh, it is t getting shredded by our guns, though. Oh, beautiful. Ah, oh, those poor robots. You're flaring too early, Splitzy. Yeah, I'm also going the wrong direction. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Eh, 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 oh eh, no. Eh. Quick, let's take blueprints. Quick, mix, 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 mix. Oh! Well, oh my goodness. Capex plane without hitting it. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. Oh, I'm like. I want, I want, I want my plane now, but we don't have enough flight deck for it. We build a flight deck back here too. Yeah, we need it. We need a flight deck for you two on that third trailer, so badly. Oh man. <sighs> so if we have a projector, I can actually load up mine onto this because it's built off of this. Unless oh. wasted, you want to just get yours built first. What was that? Uh. We're going to do a second flight deck so we can have multiple planes sorting at the same time. And I do have a, I do have a blueprint of mine ready to go. But if you want to get yours built for first, it is kind of your design of the rover. So figured right at first refusal goes good. to you. <laughs> you having fun I'm with your captured rover? On I'm having fun watching them try and grind me down to try and get it back. <laughs> As I run them over. Oh, fact, you want it? You, you want it back? You want it back? It's fine. It'll be. It'll be over here by the base, getting shot at. Oh, oh I. I really want to get out there and see what you're doing. 
Have you taken control of yours, Wasted? Oh. Was that a Wasted that just blew up? Might have been. <laughs> Uh, apparently I was not going to be allowed to hack that, so, um, let's just sacrifice it instead. Okie dokie. I did watch you get <laughs> one up. <laughs> yep. So, cap hack. That's, that's an interesting design you've gone for there. Yep. Also, you might need some strength on those wheels. Uh, it is not in the right direction. Hydrogen tanks are full. What the? <sighs> oh yeah, I need to put the beacon back on my plane. I totally forgot that. Thank you, chat. Oops. How much of this runway I'm going to have to add to take retake control of this grid? There we go. So is everyone dropping flat frames again? Uh, I'm starting to get a little chunky, but not too bad. Uh, it also might just be there are enough people in the world, that the server's just having an issue. I never really start, so I'm about to reconnect. Yes, as I suspect, it's Space Engineers is using 13 gigs of RAM, and it's just going up. Oh, I think I have what they call a memory leak. Yes. <laughs> uh, let's go trash removal. And... That's fine. Less blocks than... Eight. Player. Yep. Yep. Enable. Oh, I felt that difference right there. There we go. My uh, my space engineers is now it's just consistently using about eight gigs. I think I have a bit of a memory leak issue with this because I've got, um, <laughs> not only am I running uh, the plugin loader, but I'm ah. also running, uh, I can't remember the name of the plugin thing now, D-Shade. Yeah, that'll do it. D-Shade? Reshade. Oh, Reshade. Uh, so one of those probably has the leak then, I guess. Yeah, I don't know. Certainly will be contributing. Hmm. So yeah, it's been a long while since I've had a memory leak in SE. Um, and for those wondering, yes, I am using a torch server to run this, but no, I am not using concealment. The uh, torch concealment. Because. Uh, some of the NPCs don't like it. Yep. The box on top of Catholic's plane is off-center. That's because he has even number symmetry. I don't It'll think that's going to be the biggest issue for him, but it's going to be fun watching him figure it out. Uh, he could probably put the solar panels on top of the wings. Uh, they're just temporary. Yeah, all of our vehicles have a significant nervous twitch. I'm wondering if the server might need a, a kick. 
Yeah. Oh man, we're gonna need lots and lots of fuel plates. Yep, and I oh. keep taking as many as I can to try and finish this expansion to the runway so Capac and I can drive past each other. Right. Uh, I think I'm good for a test flight. Okay. Um, now, is there any way well, I can actually, ride shotgun with you? I might make the tail section a little bigger. Just wing walk, it works pretty well. Alright, I'll give it a go. Ooh, it looks good in red. I like Capac's design. It like it looks pretty. I'm wondering if I need to reconnect. Or is the whole the whole rover kind of dancing back and forth for everybody else? Depends where I am. Like when I stay still, no. When I go onto the front grid. Or when I get close to it, yes, but then when I land on it, no. Okay. Having reconnected, everything is stable and in position. Uh -huh. Pressing F5. Nothing is jiggling, nothing is moving, nothing is in weird places. Uh, uh, why has it not put bullets in the other gun? Is it not piped? Oh, it won't, it won't transfer from one gun to another. No, but there's, it should all be connected up, though. Yeah, but if you only put a little bit in one gun, I'll go greedy style and nick all of it. He's got ammo in both guns. Come back, there's gun. In, there's ammo in both guns. There's three in one and four in the other. Well, it wasn't firing the same. Yeah, you got to hold there. down for a bit longer, and then it'll, both will fire. Or did you run out of power? <laughs> I don't run out of power, jeez. But no, I have run out of power. What? There you go. Now you're good. Your hydrogen engine's on now. <laughs> That's not doing anything. I thought... No, I don't know. Oh, wow. Reconnect really makes a world of difference, doesn't it? Uh, alright. Um... Do you need me to move my plane? Probably. Whoa! I, you need to give me some room so I can reverse off to one side, Gamak. Alright, that should be enough room for you, shouldn't it? Yep. Alright. Let me take my position. And. Oh. Where's my dance? Let's roll it into the dark before I take my blueprint. Can't, can't be forgetting that, otherwise you won't get any lift. Although, exactly. shouldn't they be counter-rotating? Otherwise, you're going to have funny torque forces. Uh, it'll probably be fine. Uh, I mean, the mosquito did it, so it's fine. Uh, well, <laughs> hmm, actually. <laughs> a good point, because this one's rotating. I put the blades on the right way. Uh, where's the reverse... No, what? That one. There we go. <laughs> much uh, better. Much yep. better. It wasn't going to fly otherwise, but now. <laughs> the wrong brother's first plane. Oh, jeez. Do I have jetpack fuel? Yes. I'm going to have to take off on a bit of an angle. Yeah. 
Uh, oh. Uh, and I need to turn off steering on the back wheels. Back wheels? Yeah. You don't want to tail drag? I mean, that might be useful in a, uh, in a very tight environment. All right. Like your little shed there. Okay. I'm ready. ready? <laughs> All righty. Here we go. Wait. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, not enough. Go left. up! Go up! I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, where'd it go? <laughs> Just here in a hole. <laughs> oh, man. Third person camera kept putting me in really bad places and I couldn't see what was happening. Well, if you turn around, uh. You should be able to get out of here. Using Doesn't we have power. a cockpit. Oh, oh that's what exploded. <laughs> I just saw you go over a hill and heard <laughs> lots of upset noises and then he was... Capac, do you have a gyro on this? Yeah, there's two. You can see them, they're right there. Okay, just checking. Check you. Uh, I have a question about the acid rain. Yes. Uh, do catwalks the graded catwalks stop it? Nope. Nothing. Uh, yes, they will. Every Any block will stop it from going through, okay. but no blocks have any special resistance. Okay. Because if uh, I added any blocks with any special resistance, it happens on small grid as well. So the... Uh, I just asked that because the graded catwalks are the toughest block for the, the thing, so I use those as my shields. Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> hey, cat back. Um, Hammerby just said, like the movie Up, this plane started with a massive downer. Yes. <laughs> well, D.E. enjoyed that one. What? That was good. Where's my backpack. Well, I'm glad I was long for the inaugural flight of... What's your thing called, Kamak? Uh, it's called the Amazing Biplane. It is amazing. Yeah, amazingly something. Um, Kabak, I would try... I wonder if you take that the forward blocks off, the forward wing blocks off, and replace them with the, uh, the rounded blocks that have no aerodynamic effects if your wings will work better. Just to cheese how the mod works. Because it looked like you just didn't have enough lift. I wonder if Kabak stopped pushing the thruster. As a freak out. Come back. I couldn't see where I was going. Yeah, so did you stop thrusting? I don't know. Where's some flat ground? That's something that I've I've witnessed Capac do in the many hours I've spent editing his footage. Oh, uh, sl stop thrusting when something's going wrong. Just I mean, freak out good... and stop doing anything. Uh, I mean, stopping the thrust is a good. Oh, it's not unreasonable, I'm just airplane. thinking that might be what happened. Well. Loading noises. Loading noises? Exploding noises. Oh, exploding noises. More ones. Yeah, the cockpit just exploded again. Oh. Why don't you put the cockpit on top of the wing? Because then it wouldn't be a biplane, it'd be a weird plane. Oh wait, <laughs> these are the crash planes. <laughs> a weird plane, I like it. Hey, I looked at my fuel before running out. It's first time for everything. I didn't feel like it had any lift at all. It had some, because you didn't just fall right to the ground. Yeah. Well, I just tried to take off, and I didn't go anywhere. Uh, D, do you want to try the driving thing? Uh, uh, sure. Let me make sure all the stuff of what I've been building is built up, so if I get acid rain, it won't blow anything important up. Uh, I need an elevator back up, but the elevator drill isn't on. Oh, there's a hole here anyway. This is fine. 
<laughs> Just turn it on with. Uh, that doesn't need to be vision. on because there's already a hole for it. I don't think that it didn't line up. So. Uh, nice one, Mega Man Mike. It's not a biplane. It's a Y plane. How rude. Oh boy. Hey, come back. Oh, get out of here. <laughs> oh, look, and now you've ruined everything. <laughs> you pushed yourself up trying to get me off the lift. Uh, well done. Good job, Kavak. Yep, Eeyore has joined the stream. I got a gun. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but have you found your tail? So I'll just go back home and eat some thistle. What's wasted looking at? Nothing. You guys, mostly. <laughs> Do you find us entertaining? Yeah, mostly. Um, All right. So, you want me to drive, Splitsy? I was thinking that. Make some more progress. Oh, and I might have made another song, just to make sure we keep track. Oh. Oh, <laughs> I see what Wasted was up to now. Wait, Where is it? why did I crash? Well, you weren't crash. It was a, you got shot out of the air, but then there was a violent impact with the ground. So I say it still counts. Yeah, fair. <laughs> That's fair. I'll, I'll, crash landing. I'll accept that. Urgh. Now, because Kapak hit the ground twice, is that two crashes? I don't think he left the ground. <laughs> uh, wasted. Would you like a seat on my plane? Hmm. Wing walking's way fun. Oh wait, uh, might be not doable for him. The reason he doesn't want me wing walking is the same reason that it messed up that back. It's because the person on the back gets in the way of the third person camera and makes it jump around weird. Uh, it's not too bad for me. Because <laughs> I, I was having my camera off, off to the one mm. side of it. Well, and yours inevitably ends up. Like, if you're going to wing ride, you're on these wings. So not directly behind you. Hmm. Whereas I think I was midline on Capac. Probably upset him a bit. Everything's welded up enough back here. It wouldn't, won't explode right away. So we are moving question mark. Uh, let me take off before we start moving. You know uh, what? Or what don't. your sense of adventure? There's my sense uh. of adventure. <laughs> Go for it. Start driving. Uh, Wasted, do you want to get in the seat or are you going to chicken out? Oh. Uh, which way am I going, Scott? Well, 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 well. One thought was you might want someone to help D get some bits of this sorted, like, I don't know, the runway that's currently pointed sideways. Maybe. I mean, D can handle it if he, if he fancies, but... Well, I either you or Capac should go in the passenger seat because I really can't scout and pilot at the same time. I need someone else as my eyes. That runway is going to end up staying sideways. I think. Now that it's gotten bigger. Uh, it should get back. Should. Alright. Are we ready? As as I'll ever be. Oh, I thought you were going to drive while I was taking off. Oh, okay. I just didn't know which way to go. This might be a bad idea, but I'll go. Sure. I think you want to go in the direction the, uh, the plane's going. Over those bumps there? <laughs> that, was, that was close. <laughs> Is that driving or flying? Yes. Okay, now we're good. Now we're good. Wait, so, so what's... should I... Hmm? Do you go there? Uh, should I go directly over one of these bumps with this thing? Uh, what do you reckon? The wheels more purchase? 
I'm not moving. Is there something stuck? Can I pack? What? Can you help? I'm trying to recover my plane. Oh yeah, that's right. Maybe uh, Texas cold corpse will tell me. Hey Tex, is there anything in there? I can't see Steve? any reason you're stuck. On my flyby. It's just not moving. Yeah. Uh, is are your handbrake, are your park brakes on? Uh, it says off on the toolbar. Do I have to press what about it? now? Move. There we go. Uh huh. Why do you know move? Uh, apparently my handbrakes on this thing are still controlling yours. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> so I still have magical uh, integrid control. Also, I forgot my beacon. Whoops. Uh, is the drill down? Nope. Good. I can't seem to turn. Uh... I suspect this is this for the same reasons. Can I turn? Are you turning now? Am I turning the wheels? No. Okay. It was riding fine before, but now it's not. Alright, I'm going to have to come in for a landing and see if me getting out of this cockpit will switch the controls oh. to you. Why's this terrain got to be so rough? Because it, it was going fine, and then I backed up a little bit, and I'm not jackknifed. Uh, actually. But when I turn the wheels to the right, chat's got a good, forward, idea. Chat's got a good idea. I might need to copy paste my plane to get rid of those controls. Yeah. Most of you ready for a... Yep. Alright. I no longer should... Well, I hopefully no longer have control of the plane. The rover. While in my plane. Uh, I saw Wasted fly back. Is that correct? Yep. Yeah, I know I'm maxing out on power when I thrust. It's all good. That's only at max thrust. I can operate my uh, thrusters at about 70% and fly just fine. All right. Well, I think... I'm not sure how useful I am as a scout plane in this circumstance. Especially as it's getting dark. So, I want to go, there you go. to the right. I think, I think you've actually got your problem out of the way. It was that tree, I think, more than anything. Yeah, oh, you do kind of want to go to the right, but... Yeah. Should Ooh. I go up and over those hills? or Because I don't want to go down the valley, because then I'll pull it splits. Here it. we go! Yeah, oh. screw this. No. <laughs> that wasn't too bad. How, uh, how's the front of your wing looking there? Yeah, it's a little rough, but it's okay. You crashed into the crash counter. <laughs> Seemed fitting. <laughs> well, I'm I'm pretty happy with that landing. I think it'll do. try and lock my plane down. I suppose at some point I should probably try and help Kapak get his mobile. <laughs> Kapak, Darren says say hi to Kapak for me. Hi Kapak. What? <laughs> but he also said do a barrel roll. I didn't see any barrel rolls. Well, you know... Uh, I will try to remember to do that next 
time. Although, I'm sure all I'll manage is an aileron roll. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this terrain is not nice. It's no, really it's not. not nice. I, I think my best bet is going up and over that hill, kind of onto the right, and then down into the flat. So if uh, I go straight here, it's not going to work. I but think I'm, I'm trying to back up and around. I think you need to go left, DE, because we need to get toward that planet, not away from it. And going right is just going to put you in more, just as many craggies between us and the destination. Hang on, let me try and straighten her out so I can back up. Like, we need to make it over three or four of these, and then we'll have another bit of a sweet run, based on what I could see when we were flying around. Yeah, there was quite a big open area, but we, we, we're we in the wrong valley for it, basically. Yeah, and there's there are... Like, I couldn't see any way to get to it without going over some of these. Mm -hmm. And... Much as I'm tempted to, I don't think drills on the front would allow us to clear these properly. Or at least not at any pace, anyway. Huh. Yes? I'm just repeating the same maneuver over and over again. <laughs> huh. Is there steering on the rear grid? No. Oh, it's jackknifes right over. I'm trying to pull it straight and then back straight up, and then it. Mm -hmm. I need to get in the seat so we can see what's going on. So that you can might see okay where... for a bit. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's okay. Trying. Oh, uh, now you got the twist the other way. <laughs> well, batteries are recharged. They shouldn't be on recharge. I put them on recharge so that you wouldn't run out of power if the engine died. So you'd have some backup. It's like I lose all power when I turn my wheels. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, it's partly at the moment. It's the middle trailer wheels and the front trailer wheels are actually colliding with each other now, when you get to the extremes mm -hmm. of the turn. It's hard for me to see because it's all in shadow in there. Oh, hey, a light. That much better. Grrr. You could put your headlights on, dear. I did turn them off to save power. Well, the light is... Uh, I need it underneath the, the grid Middle so trailer. I can see. Yeah. yeah. Just lifting the rear trailer off the Hold ground. up. Stopping. Hold up. Wait. It has a feature for a reason. Should we disconnect? Possibly. At least the back trailer. The middle trailer, I'm concerned that without the front set of wheels, it will literally just collapse over. Because all the I... weight's so bit misbalanced. Can I try something? I think that might be part of our problem, basically, is that middle trailer and the fact that the weight is um, over the place where the wheels aren't. Okay, uh, let's let's move everything to one cargo container. Oop. There. There goes Splitsy. Nope, that was a bad no, idea. No, 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 no. It's almost a vertical face. <laughs> it's really good. It's not that good. That was pretty good. Thank you, Abbott. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to move the cargo containers back. Maybe. Well. Now now we're super jackknifed again. Get it, get it pushed out a little bit. Oh, man. That back trailer is going to have to come off, I think. It is It is now resting on the grid. Yeah. Um, yep. Okay, I made it trailer. worse. <laughs> <laughs> I've managed to construct a fairly useless rover. Now what do I do? <laughs> um. Shall we so. detach it? It is. Ooh. Uh, bounce, maybe? Pull forward, Splitsy, can you? Oh, no, you yep. can't. 
I mean, I can try. I just need to get back in the seat. I was uh, modifying Kavak's plane to try and make it fly. I don't get it. What's wrong with the design? You're stuck in the wheel. There we go. Yeah, somehow the parking brake was on on the rear section. Oh, that well, doesn't help. That's probably why it's jackknifing so bad. Ow. Sorry, go back. Oh, the runway's caught on it. Oh, that didn't sound good. <sighs> what did so we lose then? On. Anything valuable? No. Uh, the connection to the rear rover is gone. As is the projector and everything. Okay. Uh, I think the rotor that the runway is on is... No, that looks okay. Where's the smoke coming from? The back end, uh, probably. A mag plate, I think. Okay, hang on. Well, we're not getting out of here alive. <laughs> uh, we are really stranded in this valley. I was watching this runway collide with both sides. <laughs> both both the the main grid and the second trailer. Perfect. As designed. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh. Oh, so it was on the rear trailer that things got demoed. I see. Mm-hmm. I see, I see. the back it needs what uh, a hinge and a oh, just a hinge part looks like uh, is that all yes. we're missing off that back yeah it wasn't it wasn't that bad crash oh no we're missing the conveyor as well oh ah. hey hinge part yeah we popped the conveyor the hinge and the hinge part are still here Uh, our rules say that we are not allowed to use thrust on our large grid, so we will not do that. Does that be cheating? Also, it's getting propped up. This is not a good time to have been stuck. can I try and get out of here? All of these cliffs are near vertical, aren't they? Mm-hmm. That's it. Pack up a plane with a survival kit. We're flying to the other planet. <laughs> that is a l potential last resort. One I hope we don't have to get to. Uh, are we just leaving this back one here as a bad job then? Or are you no. just trying to line it up? I'm just trying to see if I can at least get these ones out. Watch out for Capac in his plane. I don't know where that is. Uh, that's exactly why I said watch out for them. It's hard to watch out for something if you don't know where it is. Oh, that means stop and look for it. Nah. Dear. Okay, right I guess in front the... of you. Yeah. Capac, move your plane. He's coming for you. Great. No, I'm actually trying to see if I can reverse up. Better than I can go forward. These trees, I think, keep stopping me. Yeah. I'll just grab a conveyor. Uh, is there anywhere through here that isn't just... What is going on with my thrusters? Horrible. Are we going to have to resort to drills? I really don't want to resort to drills. 
You got any thoughts, Wasted? Or are you just fixing CapEx plane first? I was just having a look to see if I could figure out what was up with CapEx setup. I think I might snag the drill on the second trailer. Uh, which one's mass and which one's lift? Uh, purple is mass. And... Yellow is drag. Whatever that other colour is. Is drag. Yeah, the yellowy green. Impossible to tell if you have any kind of colour blindness colour. You can check. Snagged it. That's good. That's a start. Okay, what were the settings on these uh, on this last hinge here? What the, why is that so weird? Was it just off? Oh, that's <laughs> why. Uh, chat's asking if the gravity of the other planet is close. I've messed with the gravity fields, so no, it is not close enough yet. Yeah, that's gonna be real fun. Wait. As it. Are we giving Papak cheaty wings? Yeah, that's what DE suggested. Hey, what did I suggest? Capac's using cheat wings. No, 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 not those. I said the rounded armor blocks. Rounded armor? Yeah. yeah, because they don't do anything. And I think what was happening is these rear these rear wings were getting blocked by your front. No cheat the wings, Capac. Huh? The way this works is if you've got two blocks in line, this forward block is going to do all the lift, and then this one gets ignored. What? I... So, you see where I am? By your tail? Yeah. So, see how these forward things, these are going to generate lift. And then you've got this here. Surface area gets added to the lift. But if you've got two blocks in front of each other, the front block cancels out the lift of the rear block. Although, if I'm understanding what Drago that, was saying. I don't think that's true, because that would then happen on my plane, which it doesn't seem to. I think the fact is, Cap uh, the issue is Capax using the blunt block, so it's creating a lot of drag and not much lift. You should be but using that, the 45 degree slope what? instead. On the leading edge. Because uh, then it's most similar to the shape you get out of the plates. Um, but I might be misunderstanding it, just that, from my mucking around, that seemed to be what was the difference. And it's also the shape that Wasted ended up using on his plane. So if Draco's still in chat, he can tell me how wrong I am. <laughs> Which is probably very... I also wondered, does Capac's biplane arrangement work? Like, where he's got the wings positioned? I'm not fully correct. Okay. <laughs> That's what Drago's saying. Was DE fully correct? Drago. The, the, front, the front block, does that cancel out blocks behind it? Well, the center of mass was in front of the center of drag. Which one's center of mass? That's Purple. the... Yeah, that's why... Yeah, you split, your plane's all messed up. No wonder it is. You're constantly having to push the nose down, huh? No, right? it actually flies quite nicely at about 70% thrust. Huh. Yeah. Weird. Yep. And this is why we're all so confused. Uh, I think that's because of where his... Um, thrusters are currently sitting. Might be. Oh, are they counteracting the issue? Yeah, and and at the same time, your mass and lift aren't that far apart. They're still both, like, weird. They, they could do with being slightly more over your wings, but they're still very central on the craft, meaning mm -hmm. that it's... You know, both of them are very close to the center line, so if it does tilt, it's only going to be by a little bit. 
<laughs> Draco says it doesn't fly nicely. It's because you have magic gyros. <laughs> <laughs> and it does make sense that I was having issues with flying it at speed, though. <laughs> it didn't. It wasn't my worst plane, though. That's kind of what I meant by nicely. Like I don't have to make many adjustments, and most of the adjustments I was making was because I was flying, like trying to change my angle, banking and whatnot. Right, so people think this will work then? I think it will. I'm not sure people do. <laughs> I think well, it'll help. I'm not sure it'll only work. There's one way to find out. Uh, but there is something you do need, Capac. Uh, yeah, runway. No, you got one right in front of you. You need a vertical stabilizer. Oh, yeah. I got one. It's this H2O2 generator. Yeah, <laughs> that'll work. It'll be fine. Now you got to do a single one in the middle. Well, he needs a double because he's twin symmetry. Oh. Well, actually, just leave it like that. It'll be fine. I don't think I'm that mean. All right. Um, so we're trying to get through here and then drive the other cool. part back up and over. I've got the hinges back on. <laughs> the hinge and hinge part back on. Mm -hmm. That thing is going to be a real struggle to drive at the moment. The aft one? Yeah. Yeah. All, all the weight's over the place where it doesn't have wheels. So it can't... You might be able to reverse up slopes, but then you're going to fall over going down yeah. the other side. Uh, okay, oh. that's right. I was going to move this the car. This is a terrible stairs. place to take off from. Yeah. It's you could drive past the rover and go back a bit. Also, do you have headlights on this thing? Nope. You might want some. It's kind of dark. Okay. Um. Is it Max? Yeah, the props are grinding on the wing, but Capac's got them set to maximum displacement, so... Yeah, I not just much did do. it now to fix it. Uh... Grinding off one of the cargo containers. I hope it was empty. Oops, I it. made sure it was empty first, but that's why I'm saying I'm grinding off a cargo container. So that we don't freak out. Do you want some wingtip lights, Capac? This crew would never freak out about anything. We're all such cool customers. Yep. Yep. I've never screamed loudly into my microphone to the point that it <laughs> ended up clipping, despite my compressor. Nope. Never happened. Not once. Certainly not in this stream series. And certainly not with the phrase, Oh, Capac! Wow, you just did it again. Yeah. All that. All right. Let's all that give this a shot. At him. Alrighty. Uh, so if we put if we put the weight over the back, what if you go wheels, back around behind better. the rear rover piece? Okay, he's just gonna no, he's gonna turn maybe. Like drive round behind there, see if we, there's a nicer spot. Yeah, dude. Oh yeah, here we go. Off to the northwest. I can't see what's over there. Yeah, it looks pretty clear to me. Yeah. Alright. Hang on a sec, hang on a sec, hang on a sec. I can... Which headlights did you use? Yeah. Uh... Fancy ones. Hang on, give me a sec. There we go, now you can see. Alright, if you can't take off here, you can't take off. You're rude. I feel like I should be watching this. He's going. We've got air. Well done, Capac. <laughs> We're flying-ish. 
Now, landing is the most difficult part. Just remember, Splitsy crashed twice before landing, so... It's alright, he crashed once before flying. How's she handle, Capac? Uh... Alright. <laughs> Looking good. Oh jeez, I don't know how I'm gonna land on anything. Uh, doesn't help that I'm parked in the middle of the runway. Hard. You're not parked in the middle of the runway, you're parked in the back of the runway. Uh, yeah, fair, fair, fair enough. Alright, come back, try and land. I feel like I need a lot of speed to keep this thing in the air. Uh, you do, but you also don't. So when you when you flare and then push down, ground effect takes in, takes effect when you're closer oh. to the ground. I think these gyros might be too strong. <laughs> Are you having issues with being able to roll left and right with Q and E? No, I'm having issues with if I move the mouse, I suddenly swing around to the left or right and lose all my speed. Uh huh. All right, Kappa, come on. You can land this thing. You can do it. Uh, I pretend that I believe in you. Wow. <laughs> hey, don't tip me off. I'm, I'm trying to come around towards the runway. Taking the ground down now. Oh, there. I... Mm. All right, your angle's almost good. There are no, trees, it's not. though. <laughs> okay, those trees make it almost impossible for Capac to land. <laughs> See if that makes it any better. How did yeah, you that should help quite a lot. It's still got the same problem with the other. The bit that's not even attached at the moment because you've only partially built the hangar. Yeah. And the partially built bit's over the, the bit that uh, doesn't yeah. have wheels. Yeah. I mean, I can. I think my I game just crashed. In there, hang on. While I was on the wing. Oh, good. My game did just crash. No! Okay, do a barrel roll, cap back, and it will kill him. No! <laughs> See if I can get back in and still no. be on the wing. No! No! I'm missing yeah. it! Whoa! Well held. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I I'm missed it! I wasn't having a drink on the beach at that it point. Because like that would have been um... speed. I start falling out of the sky. Are you still flying, Kevin? <laughs> you flare up and then you level back out and you'll kind of float strongly <laughs> towards the ground. Ah! Oh, I can't believe I missed that bit. Yeah, somebody will clip it. Ah. Uh. Has someone clipped it in your chat yet? I don't... I'm trying to fly! <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Yes, I see what you mean about the gyros. Oh dear. That's not good. Oh, there goes all my speed. All right. I've landed in the forest. <laughs> it's like a land you can walk away from. Winner. Oh, my cockpit didn't explode this time. <laughs> That's a good start. Hey, I'm not dead. I'm on the ground. Yeah, he fell off at some point. I think he was pretty low down at the point at which you fell off. <laughs> Where did Capac go? I'm at the base. Uh, Your plane's not on flight there's deck. There's a swooper of some kind. Oh, I think we might be reaching the max number of light sources. Where's Capac's plane? Uh, in the forest over that way. In the oh. darkness. Oh. Do, you, do you want me to try and fly it and land it? Or should we let Splitsy? I got a blueprint Whoop. of it, so you guys can do whatever you want. Someone go a bit close. Do I want to try and land Capax plane? Yes, yes I do. 
All right, where's he playing, Kapak? Show me. If you're at the base, you should be able to see it. Well, clearly, I can't. It's, it's behind like a the... Tree. Yeah, it's not even behind it. It's next to the... Oh, there it's middle of the open. <laughs> okay. All right. See if I can do this. I believe in you, Splitzy. Yeah, that plane's not coming back. <laughs> uh, okay. Might need some more ice. Do need some more ice. And the O2H2 gen that Capac removed from the top. You can see it is out of fuel. Well, you discovered it before taking off. Yeah, I'm learning. <laughs> it's baby steps, let's see, baby steps. Yeah. Uh. Ow. My face hurts. Oh. Actually, that, that's a pretty good idea. Once, I think, um, DE, once you get your longer runway built, um, it might be worth putting some beacons at distances along it. Uh, I have a beacon on. I have two beacons on each one, uh, one on each end of the runway, so you ah, can so tell you can line where them up. it is. Yep. yep. Whoa. It's Whammer. fine. Oh, that's oh, coming fine. down. Yep, that's down. Meanwhile, in my perspective, wrong way up. De welds hundreds of blocks. I watched the turrets try and take out whatever's on the ground over there while I try and get this done. Uh, Pav's right there. Yes. Excuse me, the Pav bot. Yes. The Pav bot. I'm trying. They should all change their names uh, in Steam for this to like <laughs> random robot names. You mean like 3 1. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, like... 5. 3N like W457 or, or use the same 3D. brilliant naming scheme that they've been using for the Tom Cruiser and the Carl Urban Assault Vehicle <laughs> right, engine is filling I did not need this much ice Capac you don't have a tank on that thing do you it has two small hydrogen tanks oh, okay You gonna fly with me as I try and land it? Oh, I suppose it might as well. Okay. My plane's Capac gonna and... crash. I should probably be there to see it. Capac and Splitzy's wild ride. Wasted. I need a ruling before this flight. If I crash Capac's plane, is that my crash or his? That's your, your crash, crash, obviously. obviously. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, but it's his design. Or... But that has nothing to do with it. You're the one Man. that's going, oh, I want to fly it. I want to fly it. Well, okay. No, it's your crash. Who wants no, to fly? It, it, can, it can be Capac's crash if the crash at the beginning of the series with the jalopy is Splitz's crash since it was his design. Oh, uh, yeah, uh. true. Wait, <laughs> Wasted, have you added that one to the, to the tally? I, I was only including, like, planes, planes. aircraft. Yeah, uh, fair enough. I, I wasn't including rovers. I figured that would get quite confusing quite quickly. Mm. Yeah, true. True, true. Uh, devices that had wings. <laughs> Given that Rover doesn't really define it quite well either, because a lot of these could be described as Rovers with wings. Hmm. Uh, it probably always will be. Yeah, if only we had some kind of mod that let us put aircraft gear on it. The more you complain, the less likely I am to do it. Yes, but the more I get to complain, which also makes me happy, so I'm fine. Yeah. Does it have those emergency oxygen masks that drop down from the ceiling? Uh, I don't think so, but that would be amazing. If I've got enough of this used up that I can carry the ice and the O2H2 gen in my on my person. It's gotta be getting close. Yeah. Alright, come back, you ready for this? Yep. Alright, here we 
we go. Oh, weird. It loaded the piston in fully extended. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. You didn't turn the rotors on. I don't know how you're even flying. There you go. Rotors are on. Ah, oh, nuts. Almost just sinking too late. I got too much altitude. Uh, maybe we should rotate the runway so it's not pointing directly at another large object that's pretty tall. Uh, Can you do that? Yeah, if you think there's approach. a better angle, I'm happy to give it a go. I realized I forgot to do something. I should have had Capax thrusters in a group and on and some override toggles on my hotbar. Makes it a lot easier to fly. Whoa, getting shot at! Whoa! Come on. Uh, have we got an angle? Is the runway so. set? Well, someone left a car on it that I'm trying to move. Sorry, a plane. Uh, no, I think we should leave that there. Leave it, leave it where it is. Leave the runway where it is. I'm coming in. Okay. Ready or not, here I come. Oh, you oh, no, are coming in. No, I don't. I've run out of power. Oh, what? Does that count as a crash? No, I landed. Uh, I landed, I the plane's very... undamaged, and Capax not dead. All right. This thing chews right, through power ridiculously damage. quickly. How much ice did you have in there? Well, I sort of 12% filled the um, tanks and the engine was full. Well, engines burn power crazy fast, though. Yeah, but it's... I think it's... Well, part of your issue is you don't actually have enough power generation for the amount of thrust you've got. Well, yeah, yeah there's that. I think it needs two. 1.2 megawatts per engine and 1.2 megahertz watts for every two atmospheric thrusters. So you're burning it hard. You're always at 100%. Right. Well, I will lose a couple of thrusters then. I was coming in on the right angle too. But you were going to take your own plane out, but... Uh, I was I was going to try and do the drop like a stone thing and just land. That's what I was trying to do. Oh, well, now I see why I couldn't get it to move. Because someone... Okay. Yeah, it's locked. <laughs> <laughs> it's landing gear locked. <laughs> it's not landing It's magnetic padded by the end of yeah. its wing to the wall. Yes. That was intentional. 100% intentional. Desirable, questionable, but intentional. One way or another, Capax plane is returning to that runway. Probably via crane. It is possible. <laughs> I mean, it might be one of the options we consider. Thanks, Mackle. Yeah, something might blow up soon, though. Let me know when the next landing attempt's about to happen. I will. Don't worry, I will let you guys know when I'm about to do something stupid. Actually, that's a good idea. Let's fill these tanks faster. Oh, so, we got baddies. Gunfire. Not no. baddies. It's all good. I am going to actually fill the tanks this time, I think. Be smart. So, what would have been smarter was placing the first one so that I could place another one. Put these on. Still have a cargo access. Ah! 
Uh, I think it counts as a crash if we destroy one or more blocks. Or dent one or more blocks. I guess. Mm, normally crashes are fairly obvious. Yeah. Like, I didn't crash then. I landed unintentionally. Does it make a bang noise? <laughs> yeah. Or a crash noise. Uh, up to 50% fuel now. Getting close. I'll attempt this ridiculous landing. <laughs> More than half a plane landed equals success. Under certain circumstances, yes. Hmm... What are you humming? Are you gonna that help looks me? That kind of leafy. What? Are you gonna help me try uh, when I try and fly this thing again? Nah, I'm busy. Alright. <laughs> Thanks so much, Craig. Wasted, have you ever attempted the suspension jump thing as a takeoff technique? Yeah, I've not ever got it to work. Hmm. I mean, you, you just can't get enough height. Yeah, that's what well, I actually would get thinking. the speed back up on the way down. Yeah, and especially with the drag, you'd get even less height, wouldn't you? Yeah. Wait, no, I don't. Arg. Okay, I think I've gotten the driving weight a little bit better now. Yes, it probably won't be quite so inclined to tip forwards. Okay, almost ready for my uh, next attempt. Alright, your next attempted crash landing. I'm yep. here to watch. Are you just going to fly up from down there? No. <laughs> no. That would be hilarious. I want you to do that. Just hop there, right there up. There is no way that's going to work. Uh, Kapak, you gonna ride wing again, or are you, you know, watch me from somewhere else? Oh, what was that? Alright, somewhere else it is. Someone blew up. Oh, Wasted's making his, uh, little jet fighter thing. I'm up. Tell you what. Just trying to figure out what to do wheels with. Kapak yeah. did do and something then... good with the spotlights on this. Having the three mounted so that I can see below me does help. Landing lights uh, do actually point down, so. Nope, nope, nope. Go around, go around. Yeah, that's a wave off. That's a wave oh off. Oh no, oh no! I think my space Whoa. engineers just crashed. The plane landed by itself? Okay, if Splitsy's client crashed, does that count as a Splitsy crash? Uh, yep. I mean, counts as a double crash, two crashes. What is with my space is, engineers today? Problem is he didn't crash it. Yeah, it actually landed by itself quite it well. Oh! Its front I'm not seeing any of this. Calmly sitting against the tree. Uh huh. What? Oh, Completely did I miss the runway? Unarmed. Did you miss you... the runway? Yes, you were nowhere near the runway. Huh. Yeah, that's why I was like, wave off, wave off, and you're like, nope, I'm gonna keep landing. Oh, I think my whole PC's crashed. Oh wow. Oh no, no, task manager just didn't want to come up. Okay, mm. apparently Space Engineers doesn't like the new NVIDIA graphics driver for me. I haven't had a problem. Hmm. Oh. God, this is infuriating. <laughs> One of these days, I'm going to do this thing. And for some reason, Capac chews through fuel, like, even just flying that little bit, his... Um, plane just chewed through so much more power than mine did. Like, I was able to fly for so much longer and I've only got one fuel tank. 
what are the uh rover not rover the rotor fuel usage like it's like two oh. megawatts or something or two kilowatts or something it's not That's much not that bad. uh are you turning his wheels off of drive when you're flying uh probably not back a bit Man. <sighs> yeah, I suppose Capax could be a lot heavier than mine. I think this is about as good as I can get a palm tree made out of large blocks. Make it out of large blocks? Oh, that's not bad at all. It's pretty good. Oh, uh, hello, tree. All right, let's set Camax hot power up properly so that I can do things. I love the uh, the beach scene that's just slowly growing <laughs> over there. Right, I've still got 77% fuel. Hopefully that's enough. Looks like the little whirly bit at the bottom of a blender. <laughs> yep, you're not wrong. Yeah, it's not a bad effort though, Kavak. I kind of like it. I hope to see it up closer in a moment. As oh, I take great. off again in your plane. Splitsy's flying into my tree. The sort of thing you get warned about putting your hand down the sink for. <laughs> <laughs> Told you once, I've told you a thousand times. Disposal is not for body parts. <laughs> oh no, energy low. I don't want to miss this. Nope, that's the wrong angle. Oh, there he goes. Yep, there I go. I don't have eyes on him. Oh, over, over way over there. East. Yeah, yep. I got it. It's like a giant lighted crow's foot flying through the sky. <laughs> Those spotlights do stand out quite well. The yeah, trident is that way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Coming around. Remember Splitsy saying something about not liking li night landings? Yep. I don't like night landings. It's lit up pretty well for you. It is. It is. I will admit that. Hold on. If I, I think do your the... approach angle's too steep, Splitsy. <laughs> so much. So many adjustments to make. Go around, go around. Oh no. Oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> that counts as a crash. It does, but I landed. I'm on the <laughs> runway. <laughs> you hit Kevin. Did I kill him? Yes. It's on yes. On the Worth it. <laughs> Worth it to have my name on the counter. <laughs> You're lucky. You didn't quite hit your own vessel hard enough to do damage, and so I can't put it down as two. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> wasn't too bad. That was more of a crash than a crash, but yeah. 
Dipsy, uh, crash counter, splitsy, 11, catback, 1. Wait, are you doing that? 11? They're tally marks. They're tally marks. Tallies. Mm. It has been minus one day since last incident. <laughs> 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 well, on that landing disaster, um, Wasted, what are your plans for the rest of the day? I'm not entirely sure. Uh, I presume <laughs> you're continuing streaming? Yet. Yes, I will almost certainly continue streaming. Uh, for those That's of you who want to... what I do. Yeah. So, head over to twitch.tv forward slash Wasted Space to continue on with Wasted. Um, DE, what's your next thing coming out? Uh, Tuesday, we'll have a video drop on the channel. Uh, the next planned stream I have is Friday Night Vikings, as usual. I might do more Space Engineer stuff, but there's nothing really for me to test because we haven't gotten... We haven't encountered any really new problems. Yeah. Other than like vertical cliffs. I don't know. Maybe <laughs> piston wheels. Put all the wheels on pistons and see how that works. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and Capac and I will be back for a co op stream over on Twitch tomorrow morning. So there's all oh, that yeah. and plenty more to come. And we will see you then. Catch you next time, everybody. Farewell. <laughs> Bye.